You know, it's hail. Sorry. Um, Forgot. Hail. Um, <laughs> it's something like a, lots of hail is hitting my window and our win my window is glass. It's something like that. Mm. So I was surprised. Um, and then after that, like, yeah, a few minutes, um, my sacral sac sh chakra here and uh, at the bottom, um, it, it was painful. So like that, they are on here, under here. There was pain. Yeah, it was a release. So we're lining up with the chakras, Deb. We're supposed to line up. Yeah. I can't do the arms for it. I'm learning. Just you uh, asking the Arcturians to help me with this. They're all spinning now. I'm sending Christ consciousness from the 22nd chakra into your crown. So that should be just flooding into you, into this spinning uh, chakra system. Thank you. The chakras are like, uh, you know, like suns, but the color of the chakra. Mm -hmm. So they're sparkling, uh, they're, they're lifting the light. Mm -hmm. Like, if you can remote view any of you, you can some black mist is coming off you, and this is uh, just negativity from the chakra system. It's, uh, so you had semi blockages on it, not full blockages. Pretty if you had full block, yeah, if you had full blockages, you die. Her neck, her ESP on on her, everything on her neck was a little bit blocked too. Um, mm. It's almost like there was like a um, like a screen put over her so that she couldn't use her gifts and now you like there was a clogging of her gifts and it's i'm removing all that you mentioned my neck thank you there yeah. is pain in here in the right side of my neck and that's exactly where you're is it the left is it the left yeah, the right side is pain there it's just, you mirror in it, Deb. Sometimes you mirror it, so you're looking at it, and it's your left. But I, I do that all the time. It is the right. <laughs> yeah. The neck, I've been told, is to do with you're not telling your truth as much with the people around you. That's that's self-infliction. That's what I'm being told. A lot of it is anyway. So if you, you want to open your mouth to people and you think, oh, I don't really want to uh, uh, hurt them and not saying the truth starts creating these blockages in your throat chakra and mm -hmm. the throat chakra starts going to your neck. So. Yeah. Is that true? <laughs> do you do that often? Are you diplomatic I... with people? <laughs> Well, Lily, Lily doesn't like to hurt anybody's feelings. Yeah. I don't tell what they should know, let's say mm. like that. I don't tell them, for example, I don't tell someone who likes to befriend me that I don't like her. Yeah. Yeah. I will simply... So you don't speak her. your truth. I you will don't... simply give her a gift and then I go... Something like that. So I cannot tell her I don't like you. Why? Why don't? Why don't you like him? Because oh, that—that's what you're owning. Not... You're owning that part, not liking him. That's um, creating the pain. Um, I know. Uh, she's let's say a philanderer. Yeah. 
let's say like that and i don't like that right yeah and i don't well like then that. why well if you could you be honest with her and say you your lifestyle is not something uh, i agree with so we, we could not be friends Just no 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 you could try and heal that you could try and heal that yeah. she might have a trauma and it's your job to try and fix her and see see if there's a way of fixing that yeah she, that might be a uniform her front but deep down yeah. she might be completely the opposite yeah mm. yeah and she sticks and i don't like her <laughs> you should not like you should like everyone even the ones you don't like <laughs> uh, well maybe that's why they're she's put in front of you for you to heal yeah she's triggering you and that's your job yeah, to sort out. such a manipulator like emotional manipulator yeah, yeah. I, I don't like her <laughs> but i cannot tell her that i don't like you don't don't contact me i cannot tell her that <laughs> Mm. Because I know she is in pain, mm. and I cannot, the, I cannot. I've given you two oracle cards. Do you want them or not? Yeah, sure. All right. Uh, study music. So find an yeah. instrument of some sort and yeah. study and try and learn. You've been thinking about, that, aren't you? Yeah. 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 Music. I'm dancing actually. Uh, What's the other card again, please? It's it's actually together. It's combined. It's study with music. So oh, if you definitely. if you're learning okay. to dance, get the right music <laughs> and study the right music with dancing. Yeah. Yeah. So. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. So <laughs> you, if you're dancing to like healing dancing, find a frequency to dance with it. That's it. Yeah. That's what I'm being told. Okay. Okay. Fine. Okay. Everybody here is probably saying, I thought this was supposed to be 10 minute healing. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That was long. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm so sorry. Listen, and, no, no, it's not your fault. I just wanted to get that it's clear because I didn't want to get attacked again. Yeah. <laughs> while we're doing while we're doing the 10 minute healing. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get going here. Now we yeah. have uh, Linda. <laughs> Linda, 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 let's go. Where's Linda? I cannot see her. Uh, she's not here. Oh, oh no. She was. She's out, no? Yeah, I can't see her. No, I can't see her. No. Okay, Did we, 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 we must have done it in a different timeline. <laughs> <laughs> and then now we go to the next one. I'll bring her back when she come back. Yeah. Um, Caroline. Caroline's? Caroline. Here we go. Okay. You can state. Um, I saw him. I know. Uh, Hi. What's his name? Where is she? He. I think it's an E. Oh, where is he? Oh, ah, Caroline. Hi. Okay. Hi, yeah. How are you doing, Phil? I'm doing well. Thanks for coming. Yeah. Carlin has um like a left side of the body shut down from shoulder to arms. The leg and all the way leg. down. Yeah. So half so of the So are you body... paralyzed? I wasn't. I just I, I don't know. I think I had an emotional upset, but I woke up and I just couldn't move the left side of my body. Um now I mean now there's just limited response. Like I'm limping, I can barely make a fist with my left hand. My left shoulder just doesn't respond. And I thought it was like a pinched nerve in my shoulder that affected the whole thing. But I'm not sure what triggered it. Like, I literally got up off the bed and just couldn't stand. It's the and first it's been thing like that this. I got a message of that it, it was a pinched nerve. And let me ask you something. Um, during the um, 2020, when everybody was rushing to get uh, the, uh, you know what? I didn't get it. I didn't take it. That's what okay. I, that's all I needed to know. And my father passed away in April of 2020 because they had him in a hospital and wouldn't release him. And, you know, they put him on stuff that he didn't need. Yeah, um, we, we can't, we can't say much yeah, more than that. talk about that. <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get kicked off. Mm -hmm. of, um, it's a know, crazy you, world. It's a crazy yeah, world. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Be careful with my words, but. Yes, <laughs> yeah. thank you. Oh, thank no, you. and I only said that because you yeah, mentioned. We know exactly why um, all these, the, the people, um, didn't make it 
but didn't yeah. make it. We know exactly why. Uh, yeah, but we won't go there, but can, can, my condolences there, by the way. Worst said, thank you. Did, I me, um, I've dealt with, um, I'm Haitian. And, you know, I've, I've, I've been in relationship with Haitian women and uh, their families are them. They've done stuff from their practices. Yes. And I, I was unaware. And so for me, I'm dealing with things that I just I don't know of. Yeah. And so I don't that's why I'm saying it's yeah. not just the physical it's, manifestation. Whatever the source is, is what I'm trying to clear away from me. Yeah. yeah. Is there someone that is a relationship that you ended that it was not in, uh, like a good it ended badly. Yes, she she always said to me, if I ever leave her, she would kill herself. And when I finally did leave her, within twenty four hours, she passed away. Wow. So you can uh, understand for me the guilt, the fear, the anger inside, and you know, lack of closure. Uh, how long ago was this? She passed away in thirteen two thousand thirteen. Right. Okay. And when when did you have the problems walking? That's. That's been on and off since 2013, believe it or not. Right. Okay. Right. But recently, it's just been, it's gotten a lot more dramatic. Mm. What's her name? My name? Her name. The, the one that passed away, her name is Yolene Daniel. Right. Well, what, we've got to do a few things today. Number one, you got to forgive yourself for the guilt. You really have. Yeah, you're and not it, responsible for her journey. You have to realize yeah. that. And you've got to forgive her, uh, forgive her if she's doing, if she's grounded and actually doing this. But we'll we'll try and connect with this uh, and try and release all of it. I think this is definitely uh, might be a trap nerve, but it's also uh, it looks like it's been it's either self inflicted or it's been manipulated. So we'd have to try and scan and see what where we get. What was she into? Any what what was her belief system? Uh, well, her, her and her family, Vodun, Voodoo, but I was not aware of it until her passing. So his yeah. last, throughout the years I was with her, she was doing more than I realized. I had no idea. Do you know, right? I'm not joking. I, was, see, I should have said it. didn't say it. I should open my mouth more. I did feel it was like a curse. So what happens is when someone dies uh, with a broken heart, their last breath can be a curse. Now, what that does is that grounds them. And then they start getting manipulated with dark forces. Yeah. So we yeah, got to she's, try. She's um she's not even um she's she's still walking around. If yeah. And I do think this is like we do black magic sort of thing. Yeah. Um. I think <sighs> um I think you have a, an attachment, and yeah. I think it may be her. Yeah. You've got a. Uh... You've got some sort of thing on your heart chakra. Uh, do you have difficulty having relationships now since? Oh, yes, dramatically. Yeah. So In one relationship, um, the woman actually had a dream and she heard voices saying that they want she wanted her place. So she thought somebody at her job was trying to take her job. When she went to a psychic, the psychic told her, I had an ex who passed away who wanted her position with me. She has, she's still there, hasn't got over it. She's thrown a load of rubbish at you. Uh, this is it's going to be... Than 10 minutes. We can do what we can. <laughs> yeah. Uh, mm. Big job. Okay. She's, uh, there, there's, there is a, there's a person attached to the middle of his back and, and right on the big the bone that's in the middle of his back. Mm. She's she's linked to dark forces as well, like demons. I think she's done sort of deal with them. Uh, yeah, <laughs> nice simple one. <laughs> so, okay. The person's not not happy that I found that person. Hmm. I believe it's her. Ooh. Having a tantrum. I don't know who is Zoom users. Okay. We'll do what we can now. This is not going to be one of my normal. 
<laughs> this one's this one's all yours, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> She's very, very mad. Yes. She's very, uh, us, very aggressive. Uh, mm -hmm. I think she wants to rip me eyeballs out. She's actually seeing my uh, ascended master, so. Uh, Oh, she's crying now as well. Uh, she goes from one extreme to the other. That's because she's oh. being manipulated with demons. Mm. She's scared as well because she's actually, in a way, she's committing suicide, but she's done it from the art instead of a physical, she's done it spiritually. But then, no one on the other side's uh, judgmental. You just judge yourself. So let's see. Can you see, let us know what you're seeing, Dad. A dark forces that were helping her control they brown they've done a run already so but she is she was so in love with you like a, a fate, like an over top i don't think she really knew what love was she was possessive is what it was mm. Right, if you can uh, forgive her, forgive yourself, and ask her to move on, okay? We're actually repairing her soul at the moment. We're taking the layers of darkness off her. We're transmuting all the black, all of you do that she so done. If you're saying it with your thoughts, she can hear you. Yeah. Oh, so I'm just connecting to the angels. Uh, Uriel's helping me with this. And Raphael, my aspect. We're sending love into your heart. We're sending love into her. We're taking the dark, dark energies off her. Her scream is going less. She's just, she's just upset. She, she, she's upset with herself. She's now blaming herself, so you got to just let go. It's okay. This is just a matrix reality. Sorry, I'm talking to her. It's my dad. Just got to go. She's now, you might feel that she's actually giving you an hug. Just give her a hug back. Say it was great. You know, we had our good points, obviously. And you've just got to move on. Can you feel that? Colleen, do you, can you feel the energies? Lower back. Yeah. Kundalini, basically. Yeah, what she's saying is, she's actually going now. She, she, she said something special, but I'll let you, I won't say it in front. Uh, 
she's just sending you love and hugs and she said she's actually going now you can move on with your life she's moving on with hers and actually a relative that's uh, here as well of hers it's helping it's been trying to stop her all the black magic stuff that she's done all the damning that she's done we've cleared that it wasn't that bad she was she wasn't brilliant I, it was she was getting manipulated by friends around her especially one of the relatives actually it's quite evil it's going there and it's just gone oh. thank you thank you right Right. Is she gone? Yeah. That's supposed to be an hour. <laughs> Must have fast forwarded. <laughs> uh, your cards. I did two cards, and these are quite fitting, actually. Uh, if you go meditation, balance, ask your team to help you if you ever need to. Your angels will start speaking to you while you're in meditation. Yeah, so the, you'll start hearing angels now. That was your brain was all fuzzy because of what she was doing. Yeah. How do you feel? Relaxed. Hmm? Relaxed. Yeah, if you're gonna do some healing, we've got to um yeah. heal that area in your back. Um you you have a, a an angel, uh his name is Peter. And you also have one that's John and Jacob. There's also your three angels that have been with you since you were born. A guide named Carolyn and one named Monique. Those two have been with you also since you were born. You used to see them when you were a little boy. You also have a unicorn that you used to see. A ah, I can't believe that. I've never seen. <laughs> Beat me to it. <laughs> I, I was thinking dragon. Dra no, unicorn. That's unusual. Unicorn. <laughs> Very unicorn. magical. Magical. It's, it's, a, a, it's a male unicorn. You called it Jacob, but his name is really long. But you yeah. called it Jacob or Jake. Oh. The name, it starts with a J, but it's really long. But so you, you would just, he just would tell you, call him Jake. And you, Jacob, Jake. <laughs> That's you call them Jake or Jakey, and you and you're in the astral, what you would just go kick off on your on your uh on your flying horse, <laughs> very magical, like a guardian, I mean, a protector. Would... Yeah, Deb. I really cannot believe that Deb started that because I was seeing that at the same time. I should have said that, so, so definitely. Hi, Deb, are you frozen? <laughs> I beat you to that. I, I I was just saying, I can't believe you. I was seeing it. I was seeing the unicorn. That, that's so magical that we both saw it. That's so magical. Yeah. 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 You can ask the unicorn it's for magic, your, basically. Angel name is Victor. Yeah. Angel name. You're victorious, mm. Victor. Mm. So. I, I'll give you that one, Deb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. Brilliant. Okay. It was only 15 minutes. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. All this information is being coming through to me. Yeah. So now this healing, Victor Victorious. You're going to feel this rush of energy coming through you because between creator energy from my husband and and um phillips you're, it's almost electric 
Yeah, I, I, I was doing Christ consciousness. It's like platinum ray from the twenty second chakra. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, what else was doing? And then Creator's energy is like warm water going through you. You have a, an Andromeda connection, by the way. Mm. So you've got a, a, an aspect that's Andromeda that's near you. So it might be worth checking it out by you, if yeah. you believe that or don't. Yeah. Very, very powerful. Mm. Yeah. That's, yeah. But Andromeda are one of the most powerful beings, and they, you can, if you connect, they can have connection to the Akashic Records. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, any questions? No, I was just talking about the Akashic Records every day for the past forty few days. <laughs> <laughs> you you've got access. You can get access. Just connect. You don't want to connect to the Akashic. Connect to your. Try and partly merge with this Andromeda aspect. It's which is one is it? It's a female. Is it blue or is it white? Some have glowing white energy and some are blue skin. I think, I think it's a blue one. I think it's a blue one, yeah. Is, yeah. is blue your favorite color? It is now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. oh. You had a lot then, didn't you? <laughs> Like, like, keep keep us informed anyway, and uh, if you I'm need, in touch. drink a mm. lot of water. This energy stays with you for seven days, continuously healing you. So the next twenty four hours, you're going to see a big difference. And then okay. Use from there. Yeah, re really, we should have done a separate. Then I should have took an hour, but you couldn't hang, have her hanging around too long. I have an That's, hour right now. <laughs> yeah, no, I think we've done that, but be, because she was hanging around, and. Uh, we were helping. God knows what she could have done. That's the reason why we had to get rid of her. Yeah. 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 She might, she might, you might have had an accident or something like that. You've just got to be careful because she might have thought that we're stopping you. So. Am they, I in a position where she cannot affect me anymore? No, yeah. she can't. Yeah, she could visit, but I think, I think the angels will, if you don't want it, just say stop. I think the angels will sort her out. But it was a, a relative like a a grandmother look i don't know i didn't ask was there as well and okay. uh she's very emotional so she'll yeah. go to the angelic realm and get some some repairs on the soul i think it was her aunt but an old an older like a great aunt i was told that but i said grandmother yeah. say what you've been told first i don't know one yeah. day but she yeah. was like an older, uh, really older um, mm. relative. So, so yeah, yeah. Um, just know that you're you're going to be fine. Mm. All right. That was only. Uh, it doesn't mean everyone's getting twenty minutes, but <laughs> we yeah. had to do it. We had to do it because it was too dangerous to have it around you. Yeah. Okay. I hope you feel better right now. Thank you very much. I am looking up Andromeda. <laughs> <laughs> Linda, you're here. The, the, the 10D, by the way, so they're quite powerful. Yeah. Okay, Linda. Hello. Hello. Wow. Wow, that was amazing. <laughs> Thank you for taking the time with him. Them. Yeah. Oh, that was. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that was. All right. What's going on with Linda? Linda had um, shoulder blade oh. pain and lower back discomfort, tingling numbness in feet. Oh, and sorry, I'm getting, I'm trying to record this and it says request permission to record. Except. If I could get that. My computer just shut down. It told me it needs cleaning, but I'm going to try and record it anyway. Hmm. Is that done it? Oh, it says host allows you to. Okay. 
Yeah. I did it. <laughs> I'm learning every day. Yeah. <laughs> Request host to record to the cloud. I don't know. This yeah. tech stuff's gonna drive me over. Yeah, you should have it. I'm... You should be able to do it on your computer. I should be able to. I've never got the message yeah. like this before. Anyway, don't okay. want to take time with that. Hmm. So you have an attachment. Oh no! Oh, uh, it's a woman named Pearl. Pearl. She's right, mm. and she's on your spine. And why does she want to be there? I, I'm asked. You want me to ask her? Sure. She made a a mistake. Like a... yeah. She thought you were an angel. Yeah. Makes sense to me. She thought she said you had you had a light. She didn't she couldn't find any lights. She said she didn't know where to go. She said she thought you were an angel, so she went to you. Wow. She said, Did I make a mistake? I think I said, so. No, she I said, No, she is an angel. <laughs> I think she made a mistake. Her angel's lovely and sweet and <laughs> Not always. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> they have a laugh a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just telling her that she has the same light I'm showing her how she can make her own light I wonder if that was draining me because I've been feeling oh I've been of course it is yeah I've been feeling a mess I've been feeling angry and agitated and well that yeah. wouldn't make it, it wouldn't make you angry or agitated make you tired no yeah I've got some of that going on yeah, yeah see that surrender and release Never. that's your car that means don't get angry <laughs> that means release that anger and when you can feel anger angry it's saying get some music down some frequency and let it go you you yeah. you are uh, you are an infinitive uh creator so you can make your world how you want it to be and you can get rid of that anger just by doing that yeah prime creators can create their own world you're creating anger in your world because of some of this so much triggered you to do that anger so you're the one who needs to sort that it's not the person that triggers you it's you yourself and uh you got to surrender that yeah. problem let it go and do it with music yeah yeah do it with music yeah she's releasing herself now she's leaving mm. i wonder if that anger was connected yeah. to her it must be why did i bring it up <laughs> so. She didn't seem angry, but I think yeah. she was just, um, she was quite old. She was in her 90s. Yeah. Wow. And I'm not sure if mine's really anger, just agitation, things. Yeah. Irritate, yeah. I think it's, me. I think it's because she thought you were source, which you are, but you're still, you're still here and she didn't want to be here. <laughs> so, so you got that energy of that. Yeah. Oh. She's gone. So, so let's some healing on her skin and her lower back and her shoulders and that's right where the where she was on have you, you, you have spine you know where your spine is involved it, it affects lots of areas mm -hmm. do you want do you want your third eye opening more have you been thinking about that yeah i have and i mm. yeah I, well let's try it mm. i think while she was on that was that was a layer that was stopping you. Mm. Oh.
get to drink water. Energy stay with you for a week. Hmm. I'm just sending codes into your into your third eye chakra to open them, basically. And that doesn't mean everyone's getting this. It's just uh, I was told that you're ready for it. Not everyone needs it. Can you feel that? Yeah, I can. So the codes are from source. Like dear, and some of them are from the Kashik, actually. Uh, from both. So they're like symbols that are going into your third eye at the moment. Symbols to lock in and uh, open your third eye. So you might have remote viewing from this. So if you ever close your eyes and you see the pictures, don't be scared. Don't go in fear. Just see what happens. Thank you. I've wanted to see more. I just I get frustrated when I don't. Right. Mm. Oof. <laughs> wow. How did your back? Did your back pain go? Mm. It's it's feeling less. Yeah. Yeah. So. Within the next twenty four hours, it should be gone. Thank I'm asking. You. I'm yeah, asking. Thanks. I'm asking someone called Raphael. I think you might have heard of him. Uh, yeah. I'm sending. I'm sending energy. For, well, it's my aspect. So I'm, we're sending energy into mm. the pain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she created a, a semi blockages on your chakra by being there. Wonder how long she's been there. Can you tell that? Or... She's gone now. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking too. <laughs> what else? You want me to get her back? <laughs> no, thank you. Let her go. About two weeks. How did you get her back? Yeah, in your in your third eye, you had like a, a a deliberate force blockage before you entered this realm. So they put a cord on you to to not open, so you didn't open up as much. That's been removed. You've had codes from source, and that should be fine now. So. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. I was doing a karma clearing meditation this morning, and ads keep coming on to it I, just, I was getting irritated <laughs> you buy buy without ads okay. i thought i was paying for that anyway i know uh -huh. i youtube sucks now <laughs> yeah so many ads okay so Should we proceed? thank you so much thank you, you Linda. Card? are you are you pulling cards for me oh you pulled one i pulled two oh i got the surrender and release one and you got, what did I say? Use it with frequency. Frequency, okay. So it's connected. So to surrender and release, use some meditation music. Uh, probably about six or 700 hertz sort of thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, art chakra, art chakra music, meditation. I think the good one is on the, on the meditation group I'm helping with. Okay. Uh, magic Merlin's magic on that would be pretty good. Or the other one, we got two of them. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. Good, okay. Thank no, we you. were lo mm. so lovely to see you all again. Yeah, great to nice see to you have too. Around thank again. you. Mm. And the next one will be Kimmy. Kimmy, Kimmy. Kimmy. Hi, folks. So good to be here. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> I'm called out for a little scan today for my little Obi Wan Kenobi. He's uh, almost 14, and he just hasn't been in perky self this week. He's got some heart challenges with arrhythmia. Arrhythmia. Obi, Obi, Obi Wan. And he was also run over when he was six months old and left to die. And he survived. And that's a whole nother story. But that's an old story. So we won't give energy to it. But if you pick up anything on his right hip. Well, well, I'm I'm, I'm getting he's healing you. Oh, 100%. Always. Yeah, always. that's why. Yeah. Avatar. <laughs> hey, you're supposed to look in there. Come here, little buddy. <laughs> I need to see your face, honey. You say hi to Aunt Deb and Uncle Rick. <laughs> and I we love Uncle. our kitty cats. Philip. Oh, Gram just say hi. Yeah, Grandma Philip. <laughs> Grandma Philip. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> Can you, you see them? Your you cards, by the way, is just take care of your body and balance. If you need any help, ask the like, team. I'm gonna bite you. Just let me down. <laughs> I'm sorry, Phil. What were you just saying? Balance and what? yeah, your body care. Keep up. Make sure you're. If you're well, he'll be well. Okay. okay cool. And, and balance. So you, you you've got a team there. You can ask for help. So. <sighs> On a second, you're good. You're chilling. Kitty, 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 kitty. It's received right now. He's kitty, being chill now. Kitty, 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 kitty. He does not oh, like honey. cameras. He yeah, does not honey. like cameras. He will not look at cameras. Oh, so cute. He oh, is my goodness. Cute. You, they never do what you want them to do. Never. Can you look at Aunt Dad, please? Yeah, they hate kisses. He's not having it. Scratch him under his chin. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, that's not. Oh, there. Oh, now you close your eyes. Ugh, you're so difficult. You might feel a, an there energy you around. Yeah. You might feel spirit around him actually it's a couple of uh my team at giving him healing something in his stomach he has parasites that's what i think too he's been eating too much and uh he's just he's lost weight and he's wants more food i'm like it's very unusual i thought that too i've been um oh why is your mouth? Oh, that was so weird. Hmm? Oh, nothing. His mouth just did a weird thing. I think he saw a bird outside. <laughs> he does the little cackle. He's getting healing at the moment. Off, uh... I can feel it. I can feel it coming through. Yeah. Off the... Well, it's actually the, the Morian aspect. The Lemurians like cats, actually, and they had cats in, in them day. Yeah, yeah, cool, Lemurian. Okay, dig it. They used to have, uh, I mean, I suppose saying, they used to have cats to do healing. There you go. <laughs> That's what you look yeah. at them every day. He's also got a, is it a she or no? I can't remember. It's a boy. It's a yeah. boy. He's also got a spiritual parasite as well. Yes, that's what I was just going to say to you. He, he has one in his head and he's one got one. in his spine. Is that one all? Yeah. One all, Deb. <laughs> Come here. A spiritual parasite. Yes. Yeah. Like a portal, not like a portal, like an attachment. No. Yeah, no. He's, gonna, it's, it's, it's like he's being attacked. It's a, yeah. it's, it's like a parasite, but it's spiritual. It's like yeah. Green Mile parasite, if you get what I mean. Yeah. It's also, it's also I'm being, I'm being told this came from. What, what do you feed him? 
What do I feed them? Mm. Canned food. And then I grind up uh, chicken bones and uh, raw meat and feed them that. But I haven't been able to for like three months because I hand grind it myself. And I've had an elbow shoulder uh, thing that was happening. And now I just back to healing and I might get a friend to help me grind his food because he was on a really good diet. Yeah. And then did, did you thank him for healing your, your, your shoulder? Because he was the one who was healing it. <laughs> That's why it, it's made him bad. Uh, try blessing his food. Blessing his food. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. yeah. The, it's, right. com it's coming from his food. Yeah. He's been like trying to eat. Like he eats a lot of grasses and stuff, but I notice mm. I think it's the parasite that I got to deal with because he's just acting like he's starving all the time. He never did this. And I think Deb's hit it that he's had some kind of parasite, which I could have it too. Right. So we both, but, you know, well, what we've got to do, we've got to get rid of his spiritual parasite because the spiritual parasite can create oh, and manifest okay. the parasite. Gotcha. So, yeah. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. You are being antsy. <laughs> he can feel the energies. He'll be all right in a minute. He's he's chill. He's good. Oh, maybe not. Okay, okay, okay. Jeez. He never snips at me. He just bit me. It's because you didn't thank him for healing you. <laughs> <laughs> What's appreciation? <laughs> right. We're going to put you down since you're being yeah. too... Love you, boo. <laughs> He's a high master, high master being. He's super, mm. I don't know if you're tapping into how cool he is, but. <laughs> uh, he, he's, he, he has actually been, uh, uh, he's having an experience of, hello? Yeah, he's having an experience of uh, being a cat. So he has been high beings. He has, he's had, yeah, definitely. He's been other beings. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. Yeah. He's having an experience of a cat because he won't That's what I think. I always think that he thinks he's my partner, that <laughs> and he can't be big enough. This mm. is, I get this message that he's always like, I'm sorry, I'm not your he's side. Never, he's never been, a, he's never been a human. He hasn't been a human. He wasn't. Okay. I thought, but, I had no, this but he's been, he's been alien beings. He's not been a human being. But he would have liked to have been. <laughs> like a fairy? Like a fairy kind of SB? No, not no. fairy. Not fairy? No. Okay. Uh, uh, over, over universe, maybe, or over planet. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But he hasn't been human? No. No? Okay. He hasn't been. It's the first time he's been here on Earth. Oh. But he's, okay. been on, he's been elsewhere. Okay. Which is rare, but... You feel tingling on your arm or shoulder where it was injured. Uh, no, not really. Maybe my neck a bit. Mm. A little bit of the neck there. Oh, uh, that shoulder and everything, that was stress-related as well. Stress-related feeding it. That's it. Yeah. How are you feeling? Good. Hmm. Yeah, he's just sitting on the floor beside me. He's not, he didn't run away, so that's good. <laughs> yeah. 
Thank you. That's amazing. Uh, I gave you two cards, by the way. Someone called Archangel Michael. I'm not sure who he is. And the other one is <laughs> Romance. Uh, so oh, you go. Her. It might be an aspect of him, you know. Hey, that would be cool. I'd love a Michael to show up. It's been uh, eight years of uh, committed celibacy. Uh, so I've been single for that long. It's been awesome. And just now, it's funny you pulled that card. Just this spring, I'm like opening my heart to, to that. There you go. Yeah, thanks. Awesome. But law of attraction, you eh? Hmm? Yeah, yeah. You know what's so crazy, guys? Do you see this green glow again in my space? Are you seeing it? The green glow. Remember last time? Oh, yeah. You see it? I see it again. Anyway, just yeah, just yeah, I can. I've got a scribe to do that. <laughs> yeah, I can do it. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, could do with right. a white background behind it, be easier, but. <laughs> <laughs> but I put a sheet up on my mirror because Deb, I did that ever since I hung out with you guys, just so that yeah, no that, yeah, that was a <laughs> that was that was a highway going on there. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks for that. I've been having my sheet up since, but it looks a little hodgepodge. But hey, but it is what it is. It's it stops the uh, the traffic <laughs> flow from. Uh, <laughs> It, it it might be stopping your romance the spirit will do. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> thanks, they, thanks. They, oh. they, they tend to, to be a bit dark though. <laughs> we don't want that kind of traffic. <laughs> all right. Blessed be you guys. Thank you so much. Appreciate great, you all. Yeah. Great to see you. <laughs> you too. <laughs> As always. <laughs> Lily. Lily. Go to the next one. Yes, ma'am. She has chest chest pains and kidney issues. Margaret. Margaret. Hey. Hey, you're in the light. Yeah, I'm in the light. <laughs> Just for you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Kidney I have no idea. They said it was a urinary tract infection. And at originally they said they found no kidney stones, but you know, but, doctors lie too. <laughs> the, the cards are saying this is probably what's creating it. You, you're too hard on yourself. You've got to love yourself, self acceptance. Yeah, and that could be creating these problems. And the other one is new beginnings. So you have a new uh, new project coming up. Have you got been thinking about doing something new? Uh, wanting to get back into my art and writing and just uh, mm. get out in nature more. Yeah. Do it tomorrow then, or do it today. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <Yeah. laughs> this could be new friends as well, have, by the way. You have some, uh, and they're not big. <sighs> You have some kidney stones, which are is probably causing the issues, and those are easy for us to take care of. It, that they're very easy to dissolve. Um, okay. Do you, is it like a sharp pain? Because I just got a sharp pain. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, in my chest and in my kidneys, I have a the ch sharp the pain. Chest pain. That's anxiety. You're having anxiety. Oh, well, that yeah. makes sense. <laughs> yeah, what you've got to do is try and reason how you're doing it. Why is it Why is it there? There's a reason. And you've got to put cut that out, yeah, to change your lifestyle a bit. Do that, do yeah. the walk in the, do some grounding in the in the country, uh, near the river, walk barefoot, connect to the earth. And all these matter. Okay. Every little bit matters. All right, spend more time with the geese at the river. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> let's get your kidneys flushed out. hold on one second one thing at a time okay you're gonna feel some energy in, in your kidneys just flushing them out it's warm it's gonna feel you're gonna feel warmth in your back 
I, I'm actually, I'm not sure what it is, Deb, but I'm getting that you, one of your foods you have, you got an allergy to it. It's like, yeah, I don't know which one it is, though. I'm not a good with food. It's that blessing your food, that's a good one. Yeah. Okay. Allergy, uh, uh, citrus, oranges, are you, do you love them? Uh, oranges? I, I'm getting it oranges. It would make sense. I mean, I don't eat oranges, but I uh, drink lemon juice. I'm not getting lemons, I'm getting oranges for some reason. And but, Interesting. The only thing orange I have is an orange oil. Maybe I'm allergic to that. Mm. yeah i'm just getting oranges and orange anything with orange lemons are fine even grapefruit mm -hmm. but the orange for some reason there's something in the orange that uh, you're allergic to okay i'll keep that in mind yeah and and try and, try and stay off the processed okay. food if you have it i don't know if you have mm -hmm. it yeah, but processed food. I've stopped having it myself. Aren't good for, you. for some reason, your body, um, even though you don't break out in a rash, uh, white potatoes, uh, you're, you, you. I was a pain. Now is that gone? It's a pain gone now. Yeah. Think of it's a way that much lighter. Yes to explain what your body does when you eat white potatoes oh got it your body does something it and it causes like down the road pro problems and it it it's your kidneys <laughs> it's just yeah. a, a buildup but there's uh, the starch yeah. in the white potatoes is is really bad for you but you're yeah. somebody else can eat them their whole life and not have a problem but white potatoes are really bad for you They're all coming from okay I'm getting channeled information for you yeah okay. what you could do, what you could do is start drinking spinach it's really nice <laughs> i eat lots of spinach actually <laughs> vile <laughs> what um, <sighs> I don't know how people can like that drink. Your your kidney has both kidneys have been flushed, and it's okay. going to it's going to continue for seven days, just flushing through, and all the the stones are dissolved. So just all right, excellent. Going to show anywhere, your heart. Mm -hmm. Do you have Celtic salt? Yes. Yeah, that's good. That helps. Mm -hmm. you're going to feel some energy going in here okay yeah I can start doing the healing is there a history of heart disease in your family no. well, Stroke. That, that's what gives you anxiety because uh, your heart your chest your chest pain makes you nervous because there's heart disease in your family no oh, well that makes sense and then it just carries on going round and round it just makes it worse and worse when you got anxiety just uh, get a tree name it it'll get that's all ask the tree to get rid of your anxiety yeah okay i've got a big elm tree in the back i'll okay look do that which i just put energy well father did i didn't through rick <laughs> i saw <laughs> the energy go in through all your arteries of your heart and mm -hmm. put energy through there you're not going to have a heart attack there's nothing there that's going to give you a heart attack that all your valves everything the heart muscle itself is fine the valves are all fine okay good um, we're just uh, giving you central sun energy in your auric field to build your auric field. And we also removed an implant in your auric field, not inside. So you're obviously quite powerful to stop it getting in, but we removed it anyway. Just 
Okay. Remember that you are an empath. So you're, you're feeling everybody else's energy. So when someone else is down or someone else is dumping their shit on you, you got to let it go. It's not yours. Duh, <laughs> I told I you totally... this before, honey. I told you this before. Put it on that tree. Yeah. Put it, put okay. it on Land it on the tree. Plant it in the ground. <laughs> let it go through. Let it go through into the ground. You can't keep carrying this shit around. It gives you anxiety. Their anxiety is anxiety becomes yours. You're fine. Mm. You're fine. Remember how beautiful you are. How gifted you are. Do your art. Play your music. Okay. Blast the music. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let it all go. Need all right. Need all that anxiety. All right. How are you feeling? It's like uh, I'm feeling hmm? much better. Lighter. So yeah. Chi or central sun energy is going in your Kundalini to build that up. Uh, we're actually putting uh, Christ consciousness in your crown chakra and move, making all your all your chakras move better. That's that's when the electricity starts going through you. That's <laughs> that's when <laughs> builds energy starts going through you. Oh, great! Oh, that would uh, be. Shooting lightning bolts out of very, very aware now. Because <laughs> yeah. I'm multitasking, I forgot I'm also sending that, that emerald the energy movie. into your. In the movie Grease, when they say Grease lightning, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> that spills grease. Hit in it into the river. I'm okay. not down. I'm not dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Do a minute more. Well, that back was quite painful, actually. For you or for her? For me. <laughs> I didn't hear her say I. <laughs> I did. I heard myself. Yeah, I've given you another card. Emerging. Remember, you're a prime creator, a beautiful being. Keep on thinking, remembering that. You forget sometimes. Okay. Yes, I do. And your art's now glowing a bit. I'd love to see your art. Do your art. Show it. Mm -hmm. All right. When I do it, I'm going to send it to you. <laughs> I'd love to see it. Okay. <sighs> I love it when people show me all their beautiful things. I'm not artistic at all. <laughs> <laughs> have we got any questions uh only curious question i have is uh what star tribe did i originate from i'm getting two actually is a, is a cross Okay. So which ones? I, I got Actorian first, but I also got Sirius. But Actorian's the main one. Is that what you're getting, Dev? Oh, no. Hmm? No. I didn't get anything. Hmm. <laughs> got Actorian. I'm connected to Actorians now. Even though it's, I'm, the, I, I'm a. We're connected mm -hmm. to Sirius, so and you got yeah. both. <laughs> yeah, so that's why that's why it's difficult to read. Yeah, you got two. <laughs> total sense why I'm connected to the dogs, right? <laughs> yeah. The thing is, most of us have been all of them, but it's it's like where where's Meolidio? Mine's Andromeda. So. It's really really hard because a lot of us are such old souls, and we've had so many lifetimes mm -hmm. that. It's really hard. So true. Very true. Yeah. And you're an old soul too. You've been around, lady. <laughs> Just like <laughs> yes. <laughs> <You've been around. laughs> Absolutely. And you've, yeah. some, you've had a lot of lifetimes on on planets we don't even know about. 
Okay. <laughs> so you come from places that we can't even talk about because we don't even know anything about them right. where we've mm. been around here in this universe. <laughs> we've huh? we've reincarnated in this planet a lot. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Uh, yes, I have jokes about this planet all the time. <laughs> or at least you have experience outside this universe. We have none that I know of. Yeah, I, I've been to a lot of places. I'm like, uh, I go everywhere. <laughs> yeah, see. But yeah, but you're an angelic. We are, we're not. Yeah. The thing is, the moral of the story, when you signed up to Earth, you should have read the small print. Like I didn't either. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think most of us didn't. The most of us didn't. No. Yeah, we didn't yeah. read the fine print. <laughs> uh, like what exactly Earth was like. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh well. Yeah. Mm. All right. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Hey. How are you feeling? Okay, okay. now. You feel good. I'm feeling good. Thank you. Yeah. Good. So. Okay. I have here um, a request from Kathleen because she has um, like an appointment. She has okay. to go earlier. Okay. Um, but Stacy, Gabriele, and Victoria are before her. Is it okay for the three of you? Yeah. Yeah, you? it's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Kathleen. Kathleen, iPhone. Kathleen iPhone. Okay. Is that your surname, iPhone? Mute. Yeah. <laughs> Kathleen Trigg. T R E uh, T R I G G. Yeah. I, you I need, found you, iPhone. You I found to, iPhone. <laughs> yeah, you need to demute the phone. You're on mute. You're on mute. There we go. Is that it? There we go. Yeah. Still me? can't. No. <laughs> yes, you can. Yes, you can. So you're winding me up. <laughs> of course, sir. <laughs> Simply sense of humour, Philip. I know that's mine. <laughs> Thanks for the invite. Well, I put it on your um, website, yeah. Facebook page earlier, and I thought, oh, this looks like a good crowd. So here I am. Great. Have you enjoyed it? What... Hmm? Yeah, yeah, no, I love it. I've been doing a bit of work with David Starr. Yeah, um, helping him on some technical projects. Um, so that's why I, I saw. It is he? <laughs> <laughs> he's everywhere. I, I put TikTok in. He's on the old time. Mm. Yeah. I'll, have to, I'll have to ban him. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. So how can we help you, Kathleen? I don't know, really. <laughs> all right. So let's scan your brain first of all, since you hang out with David. <laughs> <laughs> yeah exactly yeah okay let's see um, oh she's an angel too you're an angel too another angelic is now miss has anyone told you that no my mother definitely didn't <laughs> Mine didn't either, <laughs> but I'm not an angel, so. <laughs> yeah, you, you, the oracle card says that you, you do get a lot of messages in your dreams. Might be worth writing them down. And serenity, which is peace of mind, is within you. So you could go quite all the way, if you know what I mean. Uh, do you have a bloating in your stomach? Do you have a... Yes. De Deb, I can see a, a man with a, a moustache. Is, is it an attachment? Yeah. Yeah, but you it's almost it's it's different. Um, it, there's almost like there's a um, there's a shadow in there. There's like a. There's almost is that a portal in her stomach? It's a dark, you see the... Hmm. Yeah, it's an implant, isn't it? Implant pore. 
but it's like an invisible one. That's why. Yeah, it's weird. dark black, but invisible. It's, don't don't ask me. Yeah, not, <laughs> yeah, it's hard to describe. Yeah. I've had a few things like that over the last couple of years, so nothing surprises me. Yeah. Have you been so, really tired lately? Uh, not too bad. No. So what what I'm doing now in my team. The warrior team's going inside and we'll end up somewhere else. So that's what my team does, so, and I'll be with them. Do you want to carry on, Deb? Because this might take a while. Yeah. yeah I might. The guy with the mustache has a little beard. He almost looks like Abraham Lincoln. I wonder if it's my great 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 grandfather. Hmm. Was Abraham, when I uh, was Abraham Lincoln? No, no, no. I'm oh. just saying that I I came back from Mexico January 2023, and I found a book at home, and it's called. I don't have it with me. I thought I'd share it with you. The Alien Society of Winchester, 1846. James Trigg, who's my great, 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 great grandfather, and there's some significance with this book. And apparently, I'm meant to be reading it, but I, and he follows me around everywhere, but I don't know. Wow. There is a significance with that book. Yeah. Mm. I have a picture on my phone on here, but when did you get that book? It's been in my family lineage for years and years, but I only actually saw it when I came back from Mexico after I'd been activated in a stone circle in the desert by some light beings. And then I saw it. So I don't know. Where was the book? It was in my house. In your house? Yeah. I've had it all along. Didn't even notice it. You were you were activated by are you sure they were light beings? It was the guy, um it's called the Tora Mission, Central Mexico. I don't know if you've heard of it. No. I I'll send you the link to it later. I've been back twice now. I got guy. I got. I got guided there. <sighs> yeah, you were. Uh, you were linked to Orion. So nice, Orion. Okay. Oh. <laughs> uh, reptilians, by the way. Not Orions and Greys. Reptilians. Strange. It doesn't normally happen like that. They're dead now. So you also had in the bloating. You had some uh, black spiders from around in there. They leaked out of the portal. They're gone. Uh, no, they're getting gone. They're getting, you might feel this, actually. Um, Bob, my chipmunk spiritual being, is uh, going for him now. He, he'll get him. Somebody told me in a, one of my spirit guys was a chipmunk, and I thought that was really, I've never heard of anyone called a chipmunk. <laughs> chipmunk. <heard> <laughs> what? Somebody said that when... Um, they saw a chipmunk around me. This is my lady does my channeling, so I can see a chipmunk around you. Well, I, yeah. I, I, cr I created a I spiritual being, and it was a squirrel, but he oh. speaks like a chipmunk. But I've since been told he speaks his eye vibration is nine ten D. He speaks normal, but I see it as the, the like chipmunky of the film. And he's dead fast. <laughs> so, so yeah, I, I would believe yeah, he, that would be a very eye vibrational being because I, I, yeah. I tried to bring it down if you know what I mean and copied it yeah. he's eating the uh, gooey spiders now I haven't done it have you got rid of the I, see, I can't see him now well I think he was a, a part of the uh, the implant implant um, thing weird. that's weird yeah he looked like Abraham Lincoln. That's why I said it was very strange. Mm. But I, I don't think he was real. I think it was just a distraction that trying to 
throw us off the portal. Or he might have escaped from Orion. <laughs> right. Spirit, yeah. Well, I don't know. Well, he's not there now. He's gone now. Yeah. Okay. So she said that she was activated in in, in Mexico, and I I said, "Are you sure that they're um, light beings or beings of light that have been doing this?" Because I, I think she she very well have picked it up there. You've gone back twice. Yeah, but it might be light beings, but you still might have picked it up there as well. Yeah. How did yeah, you feel? I, I, I how did how, how, how did you feel? Got feeling. Well, amazing. And I have uh, a really good connection with this guy, but I have been on, I have been, I went and met some contactees and I went to the UFO conference and had some, I've been mixing with some interesting people, if you like, and, and I, lots of sacred sites. I'm being told you, you're near enough know where it's come from. You know the person. You actually know the person. So just close it, think of who would do this. I, I think I could. I, I think I know who it is. Yeah. yeah. Can I say who I think it is? This is first name. <laughs> Jerry. Right, okay. He might not even know what the thing is. Mm. Right. What I'm being told is he. he he connects with someone and someone isn't what who he thinks he connects to. It's a trickster. Right. What job do you do here? What what are you thinking of doing? Sorry, that's what I said. What you mean in terms of moving forward? Spiritual, yeah. Well, I'm I live next to the Rollwright Stones in the UK. Do you know the Rollwright Stones? Where's that? West Oxfordshire. Should... Oh right, yeah. I live in the field next to it, and I'm trying to build myself a little retreat and having a swimming pool with some crystals, an outdoor natural pond, and I'm trying to build myself a little space there. But I'm a business consultant by trade, so I also help mm. healers build their businesses. So, all right, yeah. And I'm training mm. to be a, fi a firewalker instructor in September, which will be really cool. Firewalker, you sh if you become an instructor, connect because uh, uh, where I go, to my retreats, I think I'm doing some like that. Yeah, yes, it's, it's really empowering. Yeah, so, yeah. I'll, I'll walk on any fire. I'd, I'd walk on any fire. <laughs> it's just crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I've been guided to tell you. I've given you. I've given you a card. I gave you another. Card. I was told to. Uh, I've been on this adventure. Uh, ask. Uh, I'll ask for help. Of supporting. Uh, ask for it. They won't help you unless you ask. Yeah. So. Okay. Yeah. To so give you some healing as well. Yeah, I'm giving you healing. Nice. How are you feeling, by the way? I feel amazing. Good. I'm in my happy place in Spain. Have we said which star seed you connected to? Well, when David did my channeling, he gave me the same one as yours, Andromeda. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> should, have, should have waited for me. Should have waited for me. Yeah, yeah. I, I've got something I need to share with you after another time, but something I yeah. need to, a galactic but, device I want to share yeah. with you. But I, I was, I was because of the angelic side and the geometry, which is like nine, well, 10D actually. As you said, which ones? The blue beings and the white beings. He always likes to use the blue ones. I, I get, it's the white ones. These are humanoid in a place and they glow white light. They actually, you can see the white light. They're amazing. You're, 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 that's the one. Yeah, definitely. But I'm amazed. I was, I would have said that 100%. So, so confirmation, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> uh. 
and they want to connect. Have you connected with them yet? Have you tried? No. Yeah, yeah. No, when I, I said I, when I said have you connected, I was told she hadn't even tried. <laughs> I'll try. That the I priestess is you know, is connected to me now, and she's saying just try, just connect. Yeah, okay. you got an important job, so yeah, I vibrational being, you might as well just yeah connect. The energy is very prickly, by the way. So if you ever do healing on anyone and you feel very prickly, or if you've done in the past, you're you are actually connecting to them then. Yeah. So. Okay. Well, Any questions? Really... Any more no. questions? No, I don't think so. Thank you so much. Really appreciate you all. Thank so you. A device, I'd be interested in that. <laughs> I will, I'll send you a private message and I'll share with you. Um, okay. It's, yeah. it's pretty powerful. It's a bit, I've got a bonkers story, but it's not for this because there's other people on the call, but I need to get to my appointment. Okay. okay. Right. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for letting me sort of jump in. I really appreciate it. Yeah, okay. Hey, Lily, did you get, did you miss Diane? Bye. Diane, um, Diane? Diane, Diane was um, up uh, by Linda, I mean, around Linda. Not write her name, and I saw her, then I wrote her down. Can we come take Diane? Diane, here we go. Hi, Diane. I think you're on mute, honey. She don't look like she's on mute. Did you uh, join with the sound? I don't know. Yeah, can you hear me? I can, can hear you a bit, you. a little Louder. bit. Your volume. Louder, yeah. Oh, well, you're gone. Your volume's on so low. I think. There you go. Talk again. No. It went up a little bit then, and then it went down again. No. There must be a short in your headset. Yeah, maybe. It's <laughs> I can hear, I, we can hear a little bit. We can hear a bit. Where's the, uh, where's the mic? I can't turn mine anyway. Just, I was going to say, just wiggle your mic. <laughs> can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah. Is that any That's better? That. Yes, it is. Yeah. Okay. Sorry about that. Okay. There's, is there a volume on the mic? Um. I don't know. I don't know if it's not connecting to my earphones. I'm just trying to have a wee check and see. Earphones audio. Hmm. I think what? there should be uh, volume control on the earbuds part she's holding there. There should be maybe yeah. volume control. Let me try. Is that any better? Oh, yes. No, no, I can't hear it now. <laughs> we can hear you. <laughs> oh, sorry. That's yeah. better. By the way, the cards, you got extra blessings off the angels, and oh, you. you should take care of your body more. Oh, yeah. yeah. I will try and do that. I had some um, blood tests back recently, and it said that my cholesterol level has gone up a bit. Um. And they said it's not high enough to be concerned about it, but it could be like pre-diabetic. So I'm a wee bit concerned about that. Honestly, um, don't worry about that. We've said worry. that. We've said that to me. Uh, can whatever. I tell you? Can I tell everybody why? Because they lowered. They they lowered the levels, so everybody's uh, going to show that now. Yeah. They oh, that's it for good. diabetes. They lowered it for cholesterol, so everybody's going to be borderline diabetic. And borderline yeah. everything because they lowered the levels. So don't panic. Oh, yeah. that's fine. Because I was looking into it and I was thinking, I don't I don't think I have a bad diet as such. And so I was a bit concerned, but that's, yeah. that's good to yes, know. Yes, they've lowered it. So everybody's going to be borderline everything. So I don't you love these doctors? Don't you love this? 
so the, the big pharma can get on their, you know, they can start prescribing medicine yeah. and the big pharma corporations can make more money. Yeah. I, I saw that go with that, Deb. <laughs> but they're very good, big pharma, aren't they? They're really good. I, I, I think they're doing a good job. Yes. Black <laughs> uh, I'm being taught, try and take the metals out of your body. Okay. So, cor- coriander, or cilantro. Coriander. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And if anyone's that. listening on the uh, you on the uh, on the internet, uh, it's, yeah. it's an herb. It's okay. Herb. I'm not prescribing it. <laughs> yeah. And, 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 we're not, this, we're not doctors. We're not trying to be doctors. Yeah. This is for entertaining purposes only. <laughs> <laughs> Entertainment purposes only. Yeah. Choose some coriander. Yeah, I will definitely do that. Don't put it on cheese and toast. Taste vile. <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> what you do is you have the coriander and then you you have a drink and then your favorite food and then it doesn't spoil your favorite food. Yes. Or you can States, wow. coriander is uh, cilantro. Yeah, but you can put it in your curries or something like that. I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. So make yeah. some guacamole. <laughs> <laughs> We love our guacamole here. I recommend that to everyone here, cilantro, coriander, because somehow we get loads of metals in the body. I know it's not the skies, and I know it's not the food. I just don't know where it's right. coming from. I don't know right. where it's coming from. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> and it, it, it's not, it's not uh, what you take in, uh, but it's not from the mouth. Not because they're blocking the sun or anything. It's no. just cloud cover. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's contrails with a capital N. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Um, let's see. So let's the kids just got home. It may get a little noisy here, so just uh bear with me. These walls are paper thin here. Okay. Rick scanned you. I'm gonna go through. The cholesterol's fine. Thank you. Just taking that energy that you've been creating because when you t- were told that you owned it, you don't own it. You were worrying about it. By worrying about it, you're owning it, and that's just, that's manifesting an illness. It can do anyway. Yeah. Okay. Your, your blood sugar levels are fine. Oh, thank you. Yeah, when you, when doctors are great for giving bad news, and that that bad news manifests into something. Yeah. <laughs> or can do if you accept it and own it. I don't see anything to worry about at all. That's fab. Thank you. Yeah, you're good. I, I actually, I'm not getting any information that we need to heal. So I, I've got a, I've got a throbbing foot. Have you injured your I foot recently? Foot. foot. Um, yeah. No, no. That might be me then. <laughs> <laughs> or it might be future. It might be you were getting it if you get what I mean. Yeah. Future. Yeah. Mm. Watch out for it. No, no, I'm healing it. (laughs) (laughs) I don't know what that was. Yeah, (sighs) I don't see anything. (sighs) Look really good, Diane. Thank you. It must be all the healing we've done over the years. Yeah, it must. It's great. I really <laughs> it appreciate be. it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. That's brilliant. Oh, it's so good to see you. Right, I've you given too. you, I've got two cards. I yeah. don't know if I gave you your cards before because I'm, I'm, yeah. I've got loads of aspects in my head and I'm changing <laughs> uniforms like anything. So I'm one person. You know. You know, be guided by your intuition for manifesting. Yeah, plans may change for peace and happiness. Now, a trick of manifesting, yeah, mm-hmm. and I, I've learned this the hard way. A lot of people, just say you wanted a lottery win. 
the lottery is already predicted. It's already going there. You've got to manifest the re reality to win. So you don't manifest the numbers. You manifest the reality. Yeah. yeah. So if you want to manifest, manifest the reality, not manifest what you want. Yeah. Mm, okay. okay. Thank you. So, yeah, a little bit tip there. So hopefully I'll win the lottery tonight and I'll let <laughs> me next me next time I do it, I'll be away on holiday somewhere and I'll do it abroad. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much, guys. Thank Thanks. you. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, I think one of the um, the next one is Sparcy. It's Stacy. Oh, Stacy. It's Stacy. Stacy R. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right, honey. Hi, Stacy. Hi. Hi. Um, I have a lot going on. You do, huh? I'm tired. My hips hurt. My knees. You've got a lot going on. That's what's, you know, they they they're not good. They they'll just uh, they'll just feed it. They'll feed that pain. Yeah. Right. Try and ground yourself. Uh... My knee is bone on bone. My left one. Right. And so I, I've been told that that leg is shorter than the other one. That's because the cartilage is gone. It's not short. It's just there's no cartilage. If you if it's bone on bone, there's no cartilage in your knee. So that cartilage is gone. And that's why you'd be short. How long has it been like that? Uh, the doctor noticed it last month. So I've been putting castor oil on it. Have you been having pain for years? Uh, off and on for years, but it's really been hurting now that I know that it's there. <laughs> yeah. What did you ever do any so, sports when you were younger? No, I've had a lot of I've had a lot of health problems, um, and okay. I've I've fell on it quite a bit. And it's your left side. Yes. Okay. Okay. I don't get why. You... <sighs> okay. It's not easy to try and regrow cartilage, so you got to like pull the bones out, and you got to whiz cartilage into it, energy cartilage. I'll see what I can do. See, I'm saying exactly what I'm trying to do. I'm bringing in a Andromeda surgeon. There you go. Nope, Andromeda aspect. There you go. <laughs> you don't often use him. Tell us if you can feel anything anything in that knee. I can feel you. I'm adding some Christ conscious energy into it. I'm actually using free energies to try and create new cartilage. I, I'm not 100% as well because it's so short. Just trying to pull your legs away and add the cartilage. Can you see it, Deb? Yes. Do you want to add some of your energy into this, mm -hmm. please?
What can you feel? A lot of heat. Mm-hmm. It's not hurting like it, it was. Wow. You got an Andromeda being next to you. <laughs> is that why I'm so hot? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ten D. This is ten D. This one. Yeah. It's an aspect of me, so it's theoretically it's me, but in a ten D version. You've had that knee injury for 10 years. Wow. How are you feeling? You had some pain in your neck as well. Yes. I've had a neck injury. Yeah. You can't guarantee 100% that will be done, but you should feel a lot better now. Yeah, this yeah. human body has been through quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah, the cards are saying... Uh, study so in music or frequency so are you, are you thinking about doing that I think I've been thinking about it yeah and uh, you'll get freedom then so you, at the moment you might feel trapped with what's happening and everything but your freedom is frequency study frequency there you go. thank you I gave you free cards this was, I don't know, it's just how I was told. <sighs> Anything else, Deb? I didn't feel any implants out. You never know. Why am I so tired lately? Because, because you've got a cord in your Kundalini. I was, I was told, told that you got, you, you, you've been uh, your battery for the Archons. Yeah. They're feeding off you from your Kundalini energies, and they're doing more now because of the pain in your knee, and the pain and your stress you're having. Your energy now fits them to a, a T. You see, so you got a light lift your vibration. So I'll try. I'll re- try, we'll, we'll remove the cord uh, because that's part of the reason why you're getting a lot of negativity growing at you. Yeah, it's like you, you get. Ask- hmm. Huh? Were you in a car accident or? I've you... been in many. Yeah. I've been in a car accident on my neck. And uh, I've also had abuse. Had a what? Abuse. Abuse. Have you tried releasing it? Letting it it's go. It's still there. <laughs> You got to do it. You're you're owning it. You got to forgive. I know it's so difficult. You got to forgive, let it go. Uh, because you got to move on. You got to get that freedom. Are you still have, in? Are you still in the situation? Yeah. When when I no, was. I've been, I'm I've been single for seven years. Uh, I have a twin soul. That's pretty tough on me right now. But the abuse as far as physical is now gone. My ex-husband, but we are now friends. Mm. Because I know I have to forgive so many people. But I've been through quite a bit. Mm. And I'm getting tired of being on my own. 
sorry guys that's all right okay but you have to forgive yourself first for holding on to it for holding on to that for blaming yourself partly because everyone has that in the mind sometimes is it my fault? you got to, and also keeping hold of it is the worst part because you're owning that once you close it it all goes away I think it's gone until yeah. I talk. It's brought up. Yeah. So I'm just blocking it. It's been real hard to be on my own. And my body just doesn't want to do what I need to do. Mm. <laughs> but it's made me stronger. And I can stand on my own two feet. I am proud of that. Yeah. So in your mind, I'll send the energy. Forgive everyone who's done you wrong. Send them love, even though that is so hard. It really is hard. I know that it's hard. And uh, forgive yourself for holding on to it and forgive them. I will. Have you ever done the Ho'oponopono? I have not. It's on uh, YouTube. Okay. You write down everybody that you can think of that uh, you need to forgive and forgiving yourself. It's and do that every day. It's a it's a great release for yourself and, and right right down. write them down. Okay. Then, burn, then have a sacred ceremony somewhere special and burn it. Burn them. Okay. Yeah. And then do the ho opono pono, and it's just. It's so much better for you. This is helping you. It doesn't matter about them. They have to do this for themselves. This is just for you. Okay. Very important. And a, a twin soul, if it's a true twin soul, it, it should not be this, this, whatever you're going through, this, this hard, it, can't, it shouldn't be that hard. Well, he sends me into flight or fight because that's the first thing I go into. Even though he's trying to help me, I take it as negative, I guess. I mean, he's, he's been through a lot, too. Mm. It's not that type of relationship. If it's your twin, it's not that type. You, you, you don't feel that way. Uh, I, I can't explain it to you. If you have okay. a twin soul... I don't, I don't think it's that, it's a totally different feeling. Um, and it's not, and Phil, you're an angelic, so don't, <laughs> yours well, is super different. Uh, for a human, for us, people like you and I, your, your energy is different. You don't have this fight, or you don't have this, the energy that you feel when you meet your twin soul is totally different. It's not a love. It's not a sexual. It's a different uh, I, I, I met mine on line in, in Australia and her words could break me. It's a twin. It, no romance at all. Yeah, a romance is soulmate. soulmate I met him on. Yeah. That's where I met him was online. I've never met him physically. Yeah. Right. But it's not, it's it's a different feeling and, and you, you, it, I'm, I'm it, it's, it it's, it's strange. The mood swings when I'm happy. She'd be sad when she's angry. I'll be happy. It's very, very weird. <laughs> <laughs> very hard to handle it, to be honest. Well, you've got, I was a, you, you, you've got a download to help you on that release, by the way. Oh, thank you. I, I asked My body's for buzzing now. Hmm? Um, my body's buzzing right now. That's the, the energy. download. Yeah. Yeah. Download. So, um, no, I was told that he has a dark, uh, something on him that always come is attacking me, but I don't know if that's true. So we haven't talked in about three weeks, which is fine because I'm busy doing stuff for me. Mm. So that's a whole nother thing that we'll have to get into. Mm -hmm. right well, what makes you think he's your twin flame the majority of people that's twin flames have not incarnated with them mine has not incarnated with me they're helping me from his, 
he's helping me from the other side. Rix is helping him from the other side. The way I felt connected, and I've also seen two other lives with him. You don't feel he's, he's my twin, do you? The messages I've been getting from Creator are, are that majority of, of souls on Earth have not incarnated. Their twin flames have not incarnated for reasons, okay. like the, the, for the very reason that these tell me that, that their twins have stayed on the other side to help from that. So, okay, too, people are too too focused on finding the twin flame. They, they shouldn't be focused on that. So twins tend to have your keys and your toes and everything. Uh, and you only meet them when you really need to. Yeah. But it becomes very crazy. It is very crazy. And and I see so many people focus. And I and this was a few years ago. It was even worse. And then people were looking for their sexual partners and things like that. And it's it was just ridiculous. And I you know, I used to people used to say to me, attack me because I'd say, you know, why? Why do you even care? At this point, you know, we, we should be focusing on our vibration and, right. you know, doing, finding what, what, what our purpose is, and not just worrying about a twin flame. <laughs> I was, I was on my spiritual journey. I mean, like yeah. hours of it and I met him and I came back into 3D quick. So, mm. So think about it logically. It may, I don't know, we haven't checked it out, but it might be a trickster trying to stop you. Yeah. Get you down to your 3D. Yeah. Pretending to be something yeah. they're not. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I've yeah. seen people controlled by angels and the, the tricksters. They're not angels. So, right. And I've been attacked by one. Took all yeah. my energy this way <laughs> for that day, really for that week. Really yeah. So really careful okay did, did you have a summer ear is this where you injure it? it could be the opposite side because it could be a mirror yeah it's right here i was uh, i had okay, a, yeah. yeah it's sore it always is right is here. it now is it still now because i've got yeah. the energy it's right. a knot. that's that's where all your gifts are for psychic abilities and mm. that's your that's input exactly. yeah your yeah. tools tend to be in your heart chakra, but yeah, yeah, this is the access point there. Yeah, and also yeah, link to your condo, link, link to your Kondalina. Yeah, I don't feel I can connect to the loved ones on the other side, or however you want to say that. But well, I it, read real energy with a lot of people. Just saying that I don't think I can connect is actually stop blocking you. So don't, don't even go there. So being negative. I can connect. <laughs> I can connect. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm ready. Yeah. Ready for the next? Thanks, guys. Thank yeah. you. Space B. Come. Um, oh, yeah. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hi, Dad, Hi, Rick. Hi, Victoria. Hi, Victoria. Well, a few things, but I'll let you scan my my house and me first, if there's anything. I just saw Bobby. I call him every day. I tell him I love him. Well, you keep calling him to you because I just saw him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Oh. <laughs> He's just saying hello to me. He's so sweet. He is the sweetest. Oh. My heart. He's still waiting for me to get another so he can come in. And I'm not ready for another dog yet. Yeah, I don't blame you. Seven. I lost seven. Yeah, that's all right. Well, he's not far. <laughs> yeah. 
the cards are saying, by the way, guardian angels behind you, and trust your abilities. You don't. Sometimes you don't trust yourself. Yeah. I've been learning um, and wanting to train more, and yeah. Um, when it came to, I, f I find myself. I don't know, but I'm empowering more. I'm even developing a sense of not saying aggression, but if someone, but if someone is, you know, coming to me with ill intention or something, mm -hmm. I go on defense mode. And, you know, it's really crazy. I, I will tell you one of my journeys. I was blocked. There, you know, there's a few groups. There's this one in particular. You guys probably know who they are, the ones who's usually giving me a hard time in the past. And mm -hmm. this, you know, I was trying to negotiate. Um, I have, you know me, I'm not warring, and I always look to play on the neutral side of things. But then what happened was this one moment, you know, you know, my higher aspects came through and basically I told, I told them if anything happens to me, I will, my dragon will flood the land and quake all the way to Japan. Mm. And what happened was the next time, a few days later, they did it again. I mean, like, you know, it's, People, you know, they just keep coming. They open portals to come in and do things. You know what I mean? Oh. And, and so I, so you know, so I went there negotiating, negotiating for peace and trying to tell them, you know, you know about not warring, because it's not something that I will do, and I will not engage no matter what they do. But something interesting happened there. You know, someone tried to grab me and, you know, wasn't comfortable with it. Do you know who assigned you to So it? what happened was, you know, I had a huh? do, you, do you know why know, you're here? I know I was assigned. I know what... Do you know who assigned you? What group? I do. Which group? DMR yeah. order you're talking about? The Christ cost I know. So, you know, but, but it's not the green dragon. You know everything. <laughs> it's the gold dragon. The gold mm. dragon, you know, it was like in a certain position. Um, and I have my hands on my ground, like the hands facing the ground with energy. The gold dragon merged with me. And the avatar was like like covering up the entire room. It was really large. And, you know, these, these people, I'm so, so sick and tired of them doing things to me. That you know, I've been, you know, I want peace. That that dragon's your full of self. You're an ascended ma you're an ascended master there. You descended. You descended here. Yeah. I know that's my um. You're aspect. you're 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 just being nice. That's you. That's actually the full you. It's just you can't fit yourself in that body. You're just being nice to him. You could you could just burn him out if you want to. <laughs> but, but you know, when the dragon yeah. came. And and I and I embodied it, and you know, literally, I can see the like dragon all the way up there. It was really golden, you know, lots of energies coming up. But when 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 I merged with it, the let's put it this way, the ground shook, literally, really bad, and 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 I saw that you know the the plates, the the ground was was cracking a little bit and I immediately pulled back because mm. I can't you know I don't want to nuke Thailand but I end up doing that I caused a rumble over there and the people <laughs> felt it I mean I, like seriously I, I, I've got a few places you could do that too you want me to send you the list what was that you know, then? Oh. not weird that what was that it was <laughs> I think that was Deb was it no no, who? Then I don't know who was laughing. Oh, that's weird. Like I'm not proud of what I did, but I can control it. Hmm. I I went to, you know, who that person was, and I told him that why, 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 why do we have to have war? Hmm. And I it's a big lecture. It's like a preaching, like, you know, a preaching, 
for for a peace treaty and also you know about him having his own god spark within him and why why do you have to take energy and siphon energy from other people why don't you just use your own god spark and activate it fill yourself with love and and so forth and bringing into you're gonna die you're gonna die why don't you enjoy your life peacefully instead of creating war and divide amongst the people. This is, we're talking about the dark crowd that I had to deal with. And, you know, a lot of issues have, you know, came. Um, ever since I came back from Hawaii, mm -hmm. I was going through the time portals from for Gaia and the wormholes, the, shine, the shiny ones. Do you know who they are? They came and they're like around and everywhere I go, Sometimes they're there, and you know these beings have light shooting out from them. I think that's and, I think that's some of the Emerald Order. Yes, and I've seen them know, actually. I've seen. Them. Yeah. yeah. You know. You you needed to tell us about it because you can't tell anyone. That's the problem. You want to tell it and you want to release it. You shared it, released it. Yeah. So. Well, yeah. Got that too. Hmm. Hmm. There's, there's, there's more to like you know, the witching hour. They, every now and then, a, a portal will open up, like right there in front of that room. Yeah. In front of that door, and and you know the real the, thing like put something on my ceiling can we just send you some healing victoria let's go send you, you you're breaking up something on my ceiling and boom mm. you know that sure yeah deb okay. should we just send us some we'll send you some healing i think you're getting so, a down you're getting a so download just, um, yeah. yeah sure Um, so basically, the, the something that I had dreamed it was, it was um, a group of people, uh, a lady and her friend, to visit me, to attack me, to defame me, and to attack me. And you know, when a person came pointing at me, I literally, in the you know, you know, I, I, I. Had, I fought him off, and it was effortless. Mm. And, you know, I was just showing signs that, you know, I am just not taking it, you yeah. know what I mean? And I will fight, and I will defend. Or, you know, just don't bother me type of thing. But I wanted to know um, a few things about the, the events and who's doing it. Mm -hmm. And if this this woman, um, you know, she's she seems very, very jealous, and I don't see why she would be. But she's really hating on me, and I felt a stabbing on the back too. Mm. So I'm I'm also concerned that you know there's there's maybe someone like other than my twins. My that there's other things happening to my body. Because you are staggering. Victoria. And, you know, I don't think it's issue. I don't want to go out and swim. But Victoria, I wouldn't really worry about it. I really not worry. You've just been given a download. You can another I've gave you another yeah. card, New Love of the Divine. It's of the Divine. So you're gonna give you got a download about your purpose here, more of it. So just accept it and see what it is. Ask from the Emerald Order. So I don't know what it is. Not for me. So no. Okay, good. Yeah. yeah. You're the ground crew. Yes. Yeah, all these attacks, just you, you can just, just send them away. Just send yes, them away. Yes. Mm. And you had some healing off us. Did you see anything there? I sent healing too. I saw some. Um, a little bit of um, muscle aches and pains in her neck and back that I sent healing mm -hmm. for. 
Hmm. But you haven't got any. There were some. Not, um... Yeah, you haven't got any implant, and you got nothing that they've been. They've managed. You, you're too right. powerful. As long as you shine, don't overthink what they're doing. Just send them away. You've got the power to send them away. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Send them into it, another it, dimension. It's just annoying that they just keep. <laughs> Create a portal you know, and send was, them there. Send, send them I... some. Send them to the other part of the universe. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I did one time that uh, I was at a journey. I literally opened two star gates, literally in that room, and you know I was ready. You know if they're gonna attack me, I'll just do something twenty because I, you know, that was not right. But mm. you know. I'm seeing a lot of things. I, I see like there are a lot of images. Victoria, we're not under, uh, we don't understand anything you're saying. The sun, the future of the sun. I can, you bre you're breaking up. You, you are allowed you, you to know defend. The you, cube? Yeah. I've been seeing it and attached to the sun's energy with the water crystal over there yeah that's i i feel that i have a need to um i need to access universal wisdom that's it, to you know and and you, to do that you've got to activate it it might be activated but you've got to activate it to activate yes. to get the connection to link up so, yes yeah. that was what i was I was the, being the, sure. These ones attacking you. If they carry on attacking you, you you might be the light. You can still defend yourself. It's no yes. longer that. And if you end up destroying them, send the conscious to source, because at the end of the day, we are here to defend ourselves as well. Yeah. Yes. There was a I mean, big shift after I came back from Hawaii. Yeah, it's been a big shift every week actually. Yeah. Really, yeah. yeah that's mm. Okay. So, yeah, you got a new download off the Emerald Order. Was that light language? <laughs> One more thing. Um, lady. Yeah, go on. No, there was a lady who was I'm sorry. Um, she said, she's good. She's a keeper. Don't let her go. And... She didn't seem to have a bad energy. She looked Asian, like Japanese. And I was wondering, like, since so many things were happening that time all around and multiple so, and I wasn't Victoria cannot hear you. Yeah, what, what I'll say is... What, what, what I'll say, energy, uh, Victoria, your energy, you, you know energy is one of the best in the, in the world for energy, so check the energies. You'll know, yeah? I think she's gone. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah, she's frozen. You're, you're an energy keeper, so you know what, if it's good or bad, yeah? Partly, partly connect with the energy and then gut feeling, you'll know. Anyway, you already know. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm here. Hmm? So that's the answer. The you know. You, you know by the energies. It's not my job to do your job. I really <laughs> you know. Yeah. Yeah, you do. You got gut feeling. You got you know what energies are like. Check the energy, decide then on your gut. Messages will come. You, you'll know. You'll know. I, I'm getting since she's okay. Hey, by the way. Sometimes. All right. Yeah. I think we got to move on now, yeah. Victoria. Yeah. Or we'll be here all night. I'm <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Victoria. Okay. Victoria.
You freeze. What are you doing to your energy? We have the next one. Thank you. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> Gabrielle. She's not gone, actually. I think you missed, I think you missed Janine, honey. Janine? Yeah, the way back. Way hmm. back. Way, way back. Janine was before, right after Linda Winger. Oh. Yeah. I haven't been, I, I think it was be, when before you arrived. It may have been, I don't know, but I know Janine's way back. Okay, I have not. Sorry, seen. honey. <laughs> I'm not trying to do your job. I think it got a little discombobulated today, but I, I just <laughs> scrolled back and saw Janine way back there. Okay. Thank you. Hey. Janine. Hello. Hi. Hi. I, 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 I'm not sure what I need. I just know I need something. I mean, you need something? South and back, and my cat is not happy. She keeps uh, looking around my room, right over me, and she's smacking me back around again. Maine? You're back from Maine? Well, yes, definitely. Uh, but I've been, then I went to Central Florida with my babies for, uh, I don't know, five weeks, almost six weeks. And, and you didn't I stop didn't. and see us? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Uh, I went on a 18-wheeler with my brother-in-law who was going for business. <laughs> so that's interesting <laughs> yeah hmm. okay. so you, he's a you, good you think you brought home something hmm. i feel great but uh a lot of people around this area where my sister stays and i stay now is um they're all dying you know hmm. what's like a lot of people dying around here. I think it's worldwide that by the way. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure what it is because we can't say what we think it is on here. <laughs> Can we? we 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 just think we, we can't we gotta yes. just go with a narrative. Oh yeah. 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 It's completely a mystery. But I I've I've been to a few funerals this year already. I had to carry a coffee. Mm -hmm. Well, you don't have an attachment, but you <laughs> certainly have some visitors in the house. <gasps> oh, I know. My cat is just totally suffering. I feel so bad because she's like the main caretaker when I'm gone. And she's. Well, some of your neighbors haven't um, left. Let's say they left, but they haven't left. Oh, we got engines. <laughs> Ooh. You have, well, there's, you have people that have, that are wandering around, not sure where to go. Oh. But my neighbor where in Arizona, he did the same thing, but I felt his energy. So you, you yeah. just, you know, but some have like, some that, that, that are atheists and they, yeah. they just don't know what to do. So have you ever a, have you ever connected to the elementals oh yes you have yeah they're all around yeah. you yeah they're all I, around you i i bring them I, I bring them candies um and put them in little dishes you know candies they don't have to unwrap and i teach my grandbabies about them and we pick up trash for them yeah, I, um, you know, the we had something in Maine, but I've, in, you know, I invite them to come around and help out, keep the energy high. Mm -hmm. If it wasn't him. 
a wood nymph. Oh. It's a female. Oh. Oh. Yes, I I know about time. I've seen a time guardian. I I've um, been close with Fernia and um I stay outside a lot with um, Green Tara and, you know, Kuan Yin for the properties. Never seen a wood nymph before. I've never until now. It's the first time. Hmm. Well, I didn't either until now, right? Mm -hmm. It's really Ooh. hard to be told what it was. She's, um, they're, she's bigger than a, uh, like, fairy or... She's got wings too, though. Mm. Oh, I'll check her out. I have fairy not... books and cards all over the place, so I'll find her. She says her name is Samantha. Oh. Um. I love that. I bet Deb's doing what I normally do. If I ever pick something new, I Google it. <laughs> you ever do of that? Yeah, you do. Has anyone else experienced that? I do all the time. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yes. Every... Yeah, that's how I've learned everything. My my team drops in the uh, I've never, word. I've never, I mean, I just saw this image in the, it said it's a wood nymph and she's got wings and she's very beautiful. Oh. I thought it was a fairy, but it's a big fairy if it was. <laughs> it's bigger than a yeah. fairy. Mm. The, the cards, by the way, uh, another one study for frequency. Study frequency. I think I think that's the in thing at the moment, study frequency. And you you're a bit freedom at the moment. You're more free in what you have been in the past, aren't you? The, yeah. um, the I feel it. The gentleman yeah. that's coming and going that that uh, is, I mean, he's not in your house all the time. He's just kind of wandering, and he's not doesn't mean he's not there right yeah. now, but he's been there. And that, but your yeah. your cat is seeing the wood nymph mo the most. And oh, yeah, she's like when I'm trying to rest at night and meditate and just bring it down. She's looking right over me. I'm like, oh, Lee. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, that, that's good. I can that, check that out. The spirit, I'm connected. He didn't want to go. He's not I'm arming you, so he's not affecting you. No, he's not. He, 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 don't he want to go? <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, but he doesn't know where to go either. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to get him to come okay. back so we can send him on his way to home he knows how to swear yeah <laughs> well he's around so we can send him okay is he oh. he's okay he's yeah if you don't want to go we can't force him he's not affecting you that bad is he Unless we persuade him, the other way is to get someone who, who well, knows him on the other side. Yeah. yeah, my my sister lost her father. We just found out two years ago. We don't share the same father, and her, she lost her father after she got to know him. And I know he visits because I feel him, but um, I don't think he he's older. It's, in his late seventies, maybe. Yeah, but in the spirit world, it can be the age they want it. They can represent that age right. where the, the, you know, what I mean, it could even be a child, and they still yeah. be the same. Because it's yeah. not the spirit, really. It's just what it is projecting. I think. <sighs> You're in quite a good place at the moment compared with the past. The energies are good now. I feel good. it. I just yeah. like, yeah. I'm saying 97% of my time, I want to say 98 is like, oh, just bliss all the time, mm. no matter where I am. And I 
love that. I'm just like mm -hmm. building on it. Yeah. I think your next, the next possibility is to study some frequency music and stuff like that. Drumming, do some drumming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Always a good oh, uh, You don't know my musical ability. I like to sing. <laughs> But my, my uh, we're having tornadoes yesterday, so the weather's bad. If you can't hear That's me, been. That's been really <clears throat> miserable. It's raining right now. Just started again. Yeah. So go on then. What are you going to sing for us? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my angels say, um, uh, "Why don't you sing along with somebody?" So. <laughs> You know. like, like, like study music can be uh, singing it's the same thing isn't it yeah mm -hmm. yes yeah so what are you going to sing <laughs> doesn't matter you just let it out yeah yeah really oh, hold on let's sing no 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 no, 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 no. There's a little bit of energy in your chat and your side here where your pelvis is that's just been removed. Did you ever feel anything like that? Thank you. I did feel something and I thought yeah. it was um someone that died recently. I was like, oh well, I know you didn't come in here. <laughs> so I, I'm glad it's not. Yeah. I'm gonna hang a sign on my chest that says "No vacancies." <laughs> Rick's using a sign language. I thought he was using doing something. Very bad to me. <laughs> he wanted me to plug his phone and he's doing this. <laughs> but... <laughs> I got it finally. Okay. Not much healing needed, but you got a download. You might have felt it go in. Ooh. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Yes, I, I keep having these surges while you're working today, and I'm like, wow, I got to get around my people more because, <laughs> yeah. Whew, you know. Yeah. You can feel it. Yeah. Anyway, I love you guys. Love you. Thank, you. Thanks for coming Thank on. Thank you so much. Oh my God, I've been up since right. 5 a.m. and starting to. Oh. Bless you. I'm going to watch the rest because I can't wait to see and do what you guys do. So, see, you had a lion, bye. Deb. Then. Thank you so much. Deb, you had a lion. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Fine. Now we will go to Gabriela. Gabriela has been waiting. Okay, uh -huh. Gabriela. Let me just get this fixed. What the heck is going on with this thing? Hi, Gabby. Hi. Hi. State your request. I would like um, a general scan. I would like some more energy sent to my wrinkle bone spur thing. Uh, feeling better. You have bone spurs in your ankle? I had fell on my birthday weekend and um, it was while you were on vacation and I had fell up if you could send me some energy and it helped a lot. The swelling went down and everything, but then I found out after the radiologist looked at it, he said there was like a small bone spur, which is like a little breakage by the ankle. Well, I know. I get it's really unusual to get them uh, like that. So. I had a weird stomach. Right ankle? But... Your right ankle? Mm hmm. You said around the. 
Is it around the big bone? Mm hmm Like it almost feels like it kind of like affects the top slash side of my foot because I can't really move it the same. It's a lot better. But like I tried to wear some different shoes and to kind of test if you know my work. Like basically, I've been wearing my work shoes, my other shoes. I'm like, no, but. You should, feel, you should feel the energy now, Gabriel. W or Gabriel, I can't remember. Yeah, we're good, sir. What? I did hear it. What were you saying, Dan? Your feet swelling? No, the swelling really isn't there. It's more so like a tenderness when I move it wrong. It's like, oh. That wasn't me barking, by the way. <laughs> I feel the energy going towards my stomach, which is really, really good. I had like a residual, like, like feeling from like that stomach, but like last like a week. Did you see that then, Deb? It was a device there in the foot. Yeah. But sorry. why would they, if it's a device there, I, I, I've been told there's nothing else, but I'll be missed somewhere. Device is going out now. Thank you. It's a weird one. I don't actually know what it is. So it might not be a truck. It might be. It actually is. Um, it looks like a star in her foot. Yeah. So is it, what is that? Can't investigate Bob's at it. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah, it was a cord in your Kundalini as well. Most, a lot of people have that sort of thing. That's been there. We, we've never removed it before. Uh, that's been removed. Can't, I can't see any implants. What the bloody hell is happening? It's, what it's, it's there. You can't see it, but it's there. <laughs> invisible one. I can't stand visible. One. Yes, it looks like a star. Yeah. But is that the one in the foot? Yeah. Yeah. Bob's her bone is actually a tiny little chip in her foot, but the bone, but the actual implant looks like a star. Hmm. So it was in the foot as well. Yes. <laughs> it's fine. That's a new one. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I thought I thought Bob Bob got rid of it, and no, no. He got rid of the tracker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's trying to fool us. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It took me a while to actually see it. It's, it's there. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> I wonder her foot's so tender. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I put a jump in it. Okay, I see. I see the bone spur. It's little. But look, then I'm like, there's something else there. I can't see it. I can't see it. Then I, okay. Once I see it, I have, they have, I have to, it has to show itself once I can see the energy of it. Poor Phil. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I'll actually say what we're doing now. I don't normally say we're actually going into the implant. We there's about a hundred of us going in, and uh, we could go anywhere in the universe. How exciting! That's in really Earth, cool. I feel the at, energy I'm really hot. I can yeah. feel it. That's because there's so many of us. And me dragons with us. 
And it's like it's like an inner earth base. Yeah, inner earth base. It's in there. I'm gonna go to the toilets. Uh, so we're in inner earth, but you gotta find the beings that create this because some beings are good and some are bad in the inner earth. I've never had that before. Uh, right, they, they're actually asking us for, to forgive them. Isn't that weird? <laughs> they're asking us to forgive them. They've got to sign a contract, though. Uh, we're ready to battle, and they're just, they, they've just put the we we uh, weapons down. They just wanted to experience some of your life, that's all. These are new. I've not seen these in sort of implants before. They're not even Archon. They're not Archon. I thought they were. That's really interesting, actually. Yeah. Like... So they were just looking, they weren't affecting. They were in, they were experiencing a human life sort of thing, probably getting mm -hmm. a bit of a buzz, probably getting a buzz out of it. Uh, that's not me barking. That's not them out either. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're just having we're just hugging each other. It's is is no battle needed. Oh, that's weird. Stop it. Yep, we can come back. We'll dissolve the implant. Uh, they promise not to do it again to you. Knowing them, I'll probably do it with someone else. But they, they promise. They don't. <laughs> they're not evil. They're not dark. Yeah. So, so there's no battle needed. That's good. That's awesome. Thank you. All right, your implant's being removed now. Yeah. Yeah, it's gone now. Isn't that weird? That's crazy. That's <laughs> that crazy. Weird. Right, I'll give you. I'll give you some healing while that's gone. I wonder where you put. I wonder how they did that. I can't work it. Out. I know. <laughs> that's what's running through my head too. How did you thought feel? It feels good. Oh. The middle Lemurian aspect sending some Lemurian healing into your foot now to repair anything it might have, this implant might have created. And you're also getting some, uh, I'll do this one. This is, a, this is a, from Peru, Ayosca. I, mean, really? I, I, sent, I don't think it's the I think it's just the it's the bark yeah I have one that has that which I've really been missing it's in storage right. I'm sending <laughs> that into your heart chakra You feel that? Yeah, I feel like I've had like a wall up or like build up around my heart. I did energy work earlier trying to just. You needed to release because of everything uh, that's happened in your life. You've walled your art to this world. Yeah. So it's been released now. Hi, Deb. Can you see anything? The the uh, battle in Inner Earth wasn't a battle, they surrendered. They just wanted to experience human life. And we we oh. hugged each other in the end. They weren't even dark. No. That's a new one. <laughs> so we were all there ready to battle. And they just <laughs> put all the weapons down. I don't know. Okay. Uh, 
They're quite uh, quite nice beings, actually. Strange. Hmm. Yeah, and I think that's it. How are you feeling? I'm feeling much better. I feel like my I'm like kind of growing a little bit. Like, yeah, that's excellent. I don't feel as nauseous either. I'm yeah. like, I'm like rolling my ankle. I'm like, oh, that feels pretty good. <laughs> Well, you had you had an implant and a tracker. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. We've never had that in four years working together, have we, Dev? No. Mm. I love being the unique one. <laughs> it wasn't even Arco. God knows how they got in there. We don't. I don't know how they got in there. Yeah. It's kind of a compliment because I don't really feel like my life is that particularly special right now. I'm trying to make it more special, more unique, mm. but. Yeah. Well, everybody's got a different perspective. Yeah, serenity and dreams. So, peace of mind is with you. The contact, contact, contacting you for your dreams. They have yeah. been like I've been having like my long vivid dreams again. I've been trying. All oh, like, right. Yeah, for a while there, I wasn't, and I was wondering what it was. But it was like I think I was just too stressed with work, and then I ended mm. up putting in my notice for there. Yeah. And then everything started to flow again. Excellent. Time to relax then. Free a drought dragon. Get him involved. It's neat. Well, that's yeah. typical winter. I'm going through all this and I've got a warrior's dragon. Yeah, but Garth. you've disconnected. Garth. Dragon is yeah. Garth. 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 His name is, is symbols. But it's not quite that. <laughs> um, yeah. She had to call him Garth because you'd never be able to pronounce Garth. the name. Right. Garth. Who's the lady? Garth. 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 <laughs> G-A-R-T-H. I say it differently than you guys. I don't have an accent yeah. like you do. <laughs> right. You have an accent. <laughs> Who's the lady that somebody was going on about the, the lady guide? Somebody says she was lovely, so I was like, right, well. In that. I and then you have a did I did I pick some up? Oh god, I got I have different aspects. I'm uh, get I change and everything. Sometimes my memories go with that aspect. Uh, which one is it? Oh, I said that you and a child is your younger self is lovely. I don't remember saying that. Yeah, you did. Yeah, is it true? I've got a, um, a wolf and a black panther named Zoro there. Or is that lies? I'm getting the wolf. I'm not quite getting the black pan. That could be part of this system. That's what I was wondering about. We have to move on. You, uh, you I, know, wolf, sorry. I think you will see spirit animal. Right, yeah. okay. I think the black panther so might black panther might be to do with uh, the octopus at the back. Oh, <laughs> so, right, okay. Yeah. I'll just ignore that then. Thanks so much for all your help. You're welcome. Yeah. And I'll connect soon. Again. Yeah, give it give it a few days. Give it give it a few days anyway. Right. Right. Peace and fellow. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Drink some water. Water. Mm. Even if half, half, a half a liter. Half a liter. Thank you, Lily. Mm. The next one we can, can, can I say one thing? You said you can't have water. If I can have that, you can have water. <laughs> <laughs> okay, mm. go ahead. Okay. We go to Elaine. Elaine. Hi, Elaine. How are you doing? Hi. Um, I'm doing better. Good. I had a um, cardiac test and everything's okay there. And I finally got all that excess thyroid medication out of my body and my blood pressure went down. And I changed the thyroid medication to a different one. And it's better. Oh, that's it's good. All better. In fact, now I have to watch it and make sure it doesn't go too low. 
<laughs> Yesterday, my blood pressure was too low. Yeah, isn't that it, funny? Mm. Yeah, well, I've cut drastically down on the medication. They probably don't like it, but I don't care. I'm not going to live with my heart pounding like it was. So, and I went through physical therapy and had um, help with my balance. So I'm walking better and stronger. Mm -hmm. So all that's better, but I would like to, uh, I still have a lot of inflammation in my thyroid. That test always comes back way, way high. Repeat that because we froze for a minute. I still have a high uh, inflammation in my thyroid. So I would like help with that today. Okay. Or whatever you guys, if you see anything that needs to be chased away or whatever. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. You have to repeat. I was getting attacked. I've cleared it. <laughs> I mean, crystal ball cleared it. I had a right oming on my right side there. That's what was it? Could you repeat what? that? I was completely out of it. The thyroid is still inflamed. Yeah. Um, so she's. Everything else is good. I, uh, my heart's okay. I had um, cardiac testing and that's okay. I went through physical therapy and my balance is better. I'm walking better. And I have a little more energy. Did they test your carotid, 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 what is it? Carotid arteries. I know the doctor listened to my carotid. He was looking at it? They listened to it with a stethoscope. Oh, they listened to it, okay, both sides? Mm, I think so. I'm going back in June so I can make sure they do it again. Is there something there? You have pain in the back as well? Yes, I have arthritis and osteoporosis. Uh, what part of the back? <laughs> middle. Hmm. Middle to the left a little bit. Again, it depends on the middle. It depends on how lengthy you'd be like. I also got, you got, I've got so just did a flush um, on your arteries and cleared anything. So there was um. You have an ache. Yeah. You have an aching foot. My yes. foot, yeah. Yeah. Mm? Yeah, my feet hurt. Ache. Yeah. Is it? It's quite annoying actually. The aching foot. My fifth metatarsal was malformed. Right. On both sides, one's a little worse than the other.
I don't know why your thyroid is inflamed. You don't? No. Being attacked by a virus. There's no reason. Unless a medication that you're taking is <clears throat> is causing the thyroid to be inflamed. So how much it was inflamed before I ever took it? Hmm? It was inflamed before I ever took thyroid medication. Well, were you on other medication? Um, that you're still on? Or? No, long okay. time ago I was, but I mean, it, it could be something I took years before. Uh, have I ever looked at your Kashuk records? Have I ever tried to manipulate them? No. I don't know. Because no, I'm no. getting some of this is in the Kashik records, as I experience. So, do you want, as a sovereign being, do you want them taken off the Kashik records? Do you want to delete the experience? Have you had enough of it? Of a thyroid problem, yeah. Okay. You can heal any part of my body. Yeah. What it is, sometimes you come here to sign up for certain illnesses. And I think you signed up for this one. Uh, but my, I believe that you're still a sovereign being when you're here. You've got free will, so why not cancel it? You've had the experience. Yeah. I, I just get in trouble again, that's all. <laughs> so, okay. You, you, you've signed up to have, you asked for this experience, which is why you're having it. Um, and I don't see any reason for your thyroid to be inflamed or for you having these problems with it. Because I've asked, I've, I've asked what's causing it. I get no answer. So, which hmm. tells me you asked for the experience because there's no logical reason. For no, the, the, the is have. one. The energy's still there. We've repaired it, but yeah. the energy stayed. <laughs> it's fine. You got, we got to heal the energy. We've got to remove the energy. Right, let, let's go in the Akashic records. When I when I go from this world, they'll bloody have, probably have me on the stocks <laughs> for all the changes I've done to people's Akashic records. I'll defend you. Do, do you know what my? I've got a merge with my crystal source being, so that's what I do to go in the 11th chakra. And you know the F word? My yeah. crystal source being just said F, F him. <laughs> <laughs> man. That's it, man. Am. It's Am. Yeah, that's all. You know what I'm getting at. She, she's yeah. got all my bloody swear words, and she she laughs and tells me what. I've, yeah, she, she likes swear words. <laughs> She's got like 50D and she likes bloody she's swear words. She's got a potty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> she has. And she's like the highest vibration I've got. <laughs> it's crystal source being like blue diamonds. She's lovely. But she likes swearing at me when I don't do my job right. What, she, what we're doing now, we're going into your Akashic Records. So we're opening the door on your 11th chakra. And it's like a room, room there. And in the Akashic Records, there's a table, yeah. and then your book is on the table. Uh, it's like pine wood. Do you like pine? Sometimes your the room doesn't go with a person, but sometimes it's nice and neat with pine. Yeah. Uh, oh, is that oak? That's oak. So I got it wrong. Uh, it's darker. 
so we opened the Kashi records and then she looked at the blueprint and all of it and it's all in symbolic symbols and everything so she draws it and I can see the symbols coming out yeah so but this time we got to go to the contract so that is further along so we're going further along and like uh, telling her to rub it out so we've taken the symbols out alternate finalized and then I sign it because I just like to pee them off uh, <laughs> right right now that, that, that that's been done now now we do the healing on it the removing of the energy hopefully it works hopefully they don't bloody redo it I, I have never looked at the cash afterwards I should do Can you feel that energy? Yes. I feel it in my throat. Better out. That's our energy a bit. Yeah, it's making me cough. <coughs> it's a real heavy feeling in my throat. Deb, you can help me with bring some source energy in as well. Yes, he's directing it. It says, well, your illness wasn't in the physical. Weird times. You okay? <coughs> yeah. <coughs> There's still more that needs to come out. <coughs> I I am getting that you had some sort of parasite in the spiritual. One. <coughs> we need John Coffee. From the Green Mile, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, swallow them all. That's exa exactly what they are sometimes. Oh. Uh, what, do you, what do you think, Dev? <sighs> what a day. I'll put some castor oil on it to help remove anything that's left. Mm. It pulls toxins out. Yeah. I think it was the energy. So... I think you need some frequency, some music, so let's see what the cards say. Yeah, harmony. 
Harmony, yeah. Um, balance. I get those cards too, Harmony and Balance. Uh, there you go. Thank you. Thank you, Phil. Thank You're you. welcome. Deb. You're welcome. Mm. Yeah, Harmony is like, let go of your troubles by coughing them out. <laughs> 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 he didn't quite say that, but it sounded like it to me. Yeah. Well, that's what I did. I hope I got them all. <laughs> yeah. It's good to cough them out. But it might be worth doing breath work uh, at yeah. different times. And uh, what you breathe in, you breathe in, the intention of breathing out any of the energy that's no good to you. Yeah, I have uh, tuning forks. I'll go use my mm -hmm. tuning forks again, too. Yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah, shall, shall we do them now? <laughs> I've, got, I've got everything here. Well, you have other things, other people to take care of, so I can do yeah. that when I'm... Yeah. And some drumming. Mm -hmm. Dr drumming might be good. Yeah. yeah. Or have you got any rattles? Um, No, not a rattle. Yeah. Any I, I've been learning about rattles and like rattles at uh, different woods different frequencies but a good one is if you had a copper crystal bowl yeah what you can do i haven't got one you get the crystal bowl and you 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 bing bang it where your problem is you know one of them copper crystal bowls tibetan bowls so you actually, yeah i didn't know they made copper ones yeah, yeah they're, well they're actually pretty inexpensive yeah but you actually you actually it's you know really intense how you feel, or where your pain is, and the frequency on that's supposed to heal. Yeah. Do you do it? Um, do they have them tuned to the thyroid frequency? There, there, there's a whole set of them. They're tu they're tuned to what the whatever hurts you need them for. Oh. They come in all different hurts. You can order them. Hmm. Okay. I would I would have said about five or six hundred. For that. The frequency of where, where the nearest chakra is, all the mm -hmm. chakras have got different frequency. It starts about the root chakra is about 380, and then it goes all the way up to it's seven or 800 to your crown. To be honest, I think the crown should be about 1100, but you know, you go with what people say. And uh, so I would have said five or 600 would do it. But re really, if you're playing um, it, I'm being told. I'm being told this. If you had a 900 hertz, but you were playing it right next to it, the frequency would still heal. Yeah. So I would use Art Chakra. I have the frequencies on YouTube. Yeah. They do have them. Yep. Yeah. They do. Okay. Yeah. It's getting the right. At the end it's of the day, you want to. You don't want to just get it for one chakra. You want to try and use it all. Oh, so if you can put it near the and play near where your pain is, that frequency should heal. Yeah. yeah. So I'd get Art Chakra, well, 600, five or 600 hertz, 500. Yeah. You know, when you got aspects and they tell you you're wrong and you think, so which one? <laughs> I can't blag it anymore. Can I? <laughs> can't guess. I spent, I spent mm. uh, about 20 plus hours in the EE system. And I know that's helping. I'm, mm. I'm sure that's why I had to reduce my dosage, but I want to get off of it. I'm allergic to one, and the other one doesn't quite do it. So yeah. I want my thyroid to start working again. Yeah. Well, yeah. Just he just went into the shock, the Akashic record. So there's your answer. Mm. Yeah. I've probably got a security team following me, and as when I go out, they might change it back. <laughs> no, I've never, no. I've never, I've never double checked. <laughs> Don't they're probably, do that. Like, they're probably like rats behind me now. Let's, let's go, let's go. We're taking you in. <laughs> the rats back. We're taking you. We're taking you before the council. <laughs> uh. You can't, but I can't, we can't actually stop me going in. That's a, 
gives them yeah. the Andromeda sign that they can't do that. It's, yeah. It's, well, it's, if they it didn't a... want you there, they wouldn't let you in. Hmm? If they didn't want you there, they wouldn't let you in. Well, he actually goes in with this higher sound, one of his aspects. He doesn't go in by himself. Yeah, and I, I'm, because I'm Andromeda, Starseed, Right. They're not allowed to stop me. <laughs> uh, uh, has got like uh, they've got like an agreement with the cash they're allowed to go in. So out of all the seeds, they're, they're the ones that can go in. But they do keep an eye on me. <laughs> I will. Hmm? I'll let you know if I need any more help or if you yeah. need to go check it. <laughs> okay. Let's have a look again. Yeah. Okay, they, 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 did mar they did march me off once. I was trying to manipulate my timeline. I was trying to add a lottery win to it, and they weren't happy with that. <laughs> well, that's uh, a little different, Phil. No. <laughs> All right, let's move on. It's going yeah. at 5 o'clock. Thank you, thank you. Okay. 10 o'clock there. Let's go, Lily. <laughs> it's 11 o'clock where Lily is. Going on 11. she fall asleep? No, no, I'm here. <laughs> is that yeah, ISL speaking? <laughs> yeah, I'm here. I'm so... Okay, we go to the next one. Yes. Are we finished? Cindy. Cindy. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, my English is really, um, how do you call it? It's, it's in trouble, my English, because I'm learning German language. So my tongue is... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I must, I, I mean, I'm going to the fourth level of German language and my tongue is mixed up. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you want to speak in German then? <laughs> yeah, in the jumper. Cindy, okay. Hi, Cindy. Hi. Oh, you're, you're muted. There we go. There we go. There we go. Hi. Good to see you all. You too. Good to see you. I was just kind of wanting to scan to see how everything was. Okay. Going. Um. I'm kind of blessed. I'm in a, a tight spot, still fighting the, you know, disability. Mm. Still, the yeah, doctor. Um, yeah. Uh, Monday, they're supposed to do two injections on those pinched nerves in my spine. Um, they can't operate on it because of the arthritis and the uh, osteoporosis. So it'll just deaden those two nerves. Um, and it wouldn't be, I mean, anything that would affect the way my body works. But if we could do that, that would be. Yeah, by the way, I've, I've done your two cards already. Yeah, even though you don't expect it, your your prayers are being answered. So I think it's what you, I, I drew them out when you were talking about your disability. So I think that might happen. Uh, and check your thoughts. You're getting, you're being given intuition. There you go. I am. Okay. I've, oh. I've really, yeah. Oh, that's just, you know, solidifying what I'm, I'm feeling. But it's good to have the reassurance. Yeah. Just be careful of all the stress you're getting at the moment. Try and ground yourself more because that stress is trying to manifest into a problem, into pain. The more stress you are, the more pain you're getting. I realize that. In fact, um, all of my my crystals Neck. and necklaces and jewelry 
they're still in storage. Um, I'm living in a government hotel right now while they're helping me look for an apartment. Um, but I went out yesterday and I got the bracelet and my turlamine. I got a, a, some copper. Um, I feel 100% better today. Hmm. Um, so I'm, I'm trying to manage that stress and be more positive. Yeah, that's okay. right. I'm just relieving a lot. Stress doesn't, help, doesn't um, do anything for you. You have to trust that it's all going to work out for the better. You have to just know that we'll all pass. It'll be fine. Yeah. I think it's just the familiarity of having something that I can't tangibly, you know. Yeah. Sending uh, it's like gold energy from the thirtieth chakra. I can feel that. Sending there's always something to be grateful for. Rick and I were homeless, homeless. Yeah. And the first thing I used to sit there on my pity pie, I used to sit there and feel so sorry for myself. And when you do that, you send that in, you send that to the universe and, and it continued, it continued mm -hmm. with, the, with, the, with the crap, sending us the crap. The minute I, we turned it around and said, we were, we both looked at each other and said, we have each other. I'm so grateful for that. As soon right. as you send out the gratitude, your life changes and your whole attitude changes because as soon as you say, I'm so grateful, make a list of what you're grateful for and stop being the victim. It, no matter what, we're not a victim because sometimes we make the wrong decisions and we put ourselves in these places. And I know I can sit there and list well, how I ended up the way I did. And I know what I did. And I know certain things, I, the mistakes I made you know, it, 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 I mean, I could have, like, there were other things that, that, that helped it along the way. Job loss was one for both of us, but we could have done been better stewards with our money, but we had never experienced job loss ever. Yeah. And we blew our minds. You know, again, we weren't victims. Right. You know, so we had to change our attitude and change our beliefs knowing that we would be okay we're not we will be okay no matter what yeah. being homeless was not the worst thing it changed our lives we lost everything we ended up giving everything away we had no furniture no nothing our, we lost our home we lost everything and you're going to be okay i and i truly miss that too it's taken me a couple months to kind of get to where i'm at you know, and to to take back what's mine and, you know, kind of have a little bit of help from my dentist up there telling me. Yeah. You know, even when he got cancer, he said, whatever, even before we knew it was cancer, he was just sick. He said, whatever it is, it's still going to all be okay. It is. You have to remember that. And, and so I've had a, some help along the way, but um whatever philip just did i felt 
just such such a relief and and this is my life and i'm taking my life back my children have their lives those are their ups and downs um and those are their choices to make too and right? and those are both their choices to yeah. make um and and i've you know accepted that it that's taken me a while too so i feel yeah. i'm doing so much better um you have your path you have your life you have to do this yeah i'm ready to get on it yes <laughs> you have to you have to live your life now it's time for you to live yours yeah. it's time for them to live theirs it really is yeah. it is hard for a mother to do that but they are adults well one has questioned my attitude on the other and vice versa and i just threw my hands up and and yeah. finally said you know what I don't go there and it, which was a lesson for the other one in positivity and then the manifestation really hitting right in the face he said I can't believe this is so fucking simple yeah. you know so I'm making breakthroughs as well as breaking away you know but I'm I'm ready I'm but it's, it's all so, gonna be okay is yep, it it's all gonna be okay yeah yeah and your best life is is around the corner. Oh, it is. I'm ready. I'm rolling. I'm going to get it. You know, the place is going to come up. Everything yeah. else is too blessed to be stressed. That's right. And it stress doesn't bring anything but sickness. So it, there's no reason to get stressed. It's, it's going to be okay. Yeah. You, you got archangels, you got angels, you got guides. They're, they don't let you down. No. You have to trust. Just trust. And it's, it may be hard, but you got to do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I screwed up the other day. It was my own fault. I wrote down an appointment wrong. Uh, you know, was it kind of a big deal? Point? Well, you know, but, you maybe, know, I'm going to reschedule. And I just told myself, to no, my angels told me right away that appointment wasn't supposed to happen. And they came in, they said, you know what, take your ass to Walmart, you got stuff to pick up, there's no, it doesn't matter, it's raining, you have a good day, your umbrella, you know, the world's not going to end tomorrow. That's right. <laughs> so what? Off we go. The world's not going to end anyway. <laughs> well, no, but just because of my, you know, in yeah. metaphorically, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I need to watch that too. <laughs> You're going to be fine. But I want to, I love all of you. And I want to tell you, I've just, I've been on here the whole time and just so much information and re reminders of, of things. And, you know, I, I really enjoyed myself today. Good. And sending you all love and light. We're going because... to send you some energy right now, some more energy. And then... Yeah. Do you, can, can I say one thing? We're still learning, we're all learning. I, I've connect, I've connected to someone who's very similar to me and he's on Rob's event and I've helped him but he's very similar to me and I like how he does things that's why I've changed I've actually changed the way I do things so that just shows you after, after 50 years of healing I've, I've done it differently today yes he actually informs people of what's going on <laughs> he's, he's well, I, I never tell them <laughs> Yeah, what it was. I I, I, imagine me saying, "I've just gone into you. I've just gone into your heart chakra. There was a portal there. I've just gone on Orion. I've just killed two thousand Orions." <laughs> People have fear, and I was thinking, "I can't tell them that." <laughs> oh, I, I, <laughs> yeah. See, I, you know, to me that that I I don't fear that, but. Yeah just in my own way trying to tell someone else what's going on with them and mm. they're looking at me like oh my is she a witch is she is no. she a weirdo <laughs> you pass the test when they, you pass the test on if you think you're a weirdo <laughs> yeah. and i did get the bob zaney reference earlier i know you're yeah. you know your little helper bob but i did get the bob zaney reference <laughs> I actually met him. I, I bet so. I bet some people think they should be locked up. <laughs> well, me yeah. too. Especially yeah. when I start channeling dead people. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I channeled I dead people. <laughs> I did channel dead people, I know. I know. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. I, I, I try not make make out that I know over there. I don't want them queuing up for messages. Yeah. <laughs> I just, yeah. I just I, think, ignore them. They don't hmm? leave me alone until I give the person the message. They give, do they give you an headache? Well, they do that and they start, they shout in my ear. Yeah. Tell yeah. them, tell them, tell them. Yes, I have had very persistent ones like that. That also, mm. I, I, you know, in my younger years, I felt like I was a uh, Whoopi Goldberg in the movie Ghost, where they were just <laughs> all around, and I was like, oh, okay, so you know what, we need to set some boundaries here and some permission. Mm. I, yeah. I remember, I remember a fourteen-year-old, and she used to go in the toilet, and you queuing up while she's on the toilet. Bless her. <laughs> But she used to tell him to pay off. <laughs> she, 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 she got angry with it. Can't even have any privacy in the ghost world. I know. <laughs> One guy didn't want to leave the house. He kept shoving me and, you know, I offered to help him and he didn't want to go. So we just made an agreement. And then after that, you know, greet each other every day. And then we just went on. Mm, that's good. But I know you have people to get to. So yeah. I... So oh, we, did we say we're giving her some healing, or yeah, did we do? Give her, some give her some energy. Yeah. Okay. She she's energy. So much healing. I I think she's. I mean, I, everything yeah. that we've got is uh, under control right now. So some... I'll give you some of me chia or pranic or panic, depending which country you energy. <laughs> <laughs> it's all the same. Like life force energy. I'll give you some life force energy. I can refill it later then. And it relieves some of the anxiety that you have. We just we don't need that. We want to throw that away. Are you coughing then? Some negativity coming out. Uh, it's my husband. Oh. I'm meeting the wrong person then. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was shaking it out. I can yeah. feel it coming up through my throat and breathing it out. And then sometimes I just do this body shake dance thing. All right. That's done. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah. You're welcome. Love you guys. Be Love blessed. Right. Take care, sweetie. I will. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Go now next to Slavka. Slavka. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hi, everyone. Thank you, Lily. <laughs> Have you enjoyed watching it? <laughs> oh, my gosh. I mean, I appreciate so much your effort because you've been going over four hours now. <laughs> well, look, when we're healing, everyone's getting it anyway because it's very hard to target one person. So everyone gets a bit of healing a lot of times. De Deb, you are muted. Debbie, you sound you sound better muted. Deb. <laughs> Mute. <laughs> there. Well, it was supposed to be ten minute healing, but obviously we blew that a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> it turned into a normal healing session. Everybody got an hour. <laughs> do, you, do you know this is like one of my? This is when I do my three D job. Yeah, it'd be done in two hours, and it only takes five. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just like that. Like, just like being at work. Oh. <laughs> so yeah. everybody made out pretty good today. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. For you today? <laughs> well, 
I I'd love uh, some scan and whatever comes true. Yeah. 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 Thank you. And healing, obviously. Yeah. yeah. And if there are any implants or something that is interfering. Have you had any problems with your eyes? Not that I'm aware of. I actually have a really good like vision. Can you can you look into the camera for me? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. So you don't feel any pressure in either one of your eyes, anything that's not supposed to like a person. Did you hear anybody? Did you ever hear anybody talking in your ear? <laughs> do you hear any voices? Actually, I do feel pressure on the ears. I do feel that. Do you hear voices? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I feel like they're like antennas. I feel the frequencies coming. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you've, got, you've got somebody that, right behind your right eye. Do you, do you know when you said I, I thought he said, Hey, yes, he is. <laughs> <laughs> but obviously, that's the yeah, that's the, yeah. <laughs> well, hopefully, it's benevolent, something benevolent, you know. <laughs> Normally, yeah. Do you know this is I'm... it's it's a guy that used to be in the circus, he's a two headed man. I'm kidding. So we may have heard two people talking. <laughs> Did you hear two people talking? <laughs> I'm not kidding you. <laughs> two headed man. <laughs> really? I'm not kidding you. It's not really funny, but you, you <laughs> get two voices. Did you hear two voices? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just surprised. I can't, I can't, I'm hearing two names and I'm like, okay, are you twins? What am I? Tw no. Well, yeah. Why, why would they still be together? Them. Why would they still be together though? Unless they're just used to it. I think it, I don't, it, it, that's what I'm, I'm wondering. Why am I seeing this? <sighs> they didn't cross over. I mean, they didn't, oh. what? It's they could have. They could have separated. They could have said, unless it's one soul with two aspects. Well, that's a good question. Why am I seeing? Mm -hmm. No, no, it might be the same soul, over soul. Two, two, two go in, but they belong John, to the same over soul. You show me two two head two heads. I can only tell you what I'm seeing and what I'm hearing. And it's and it's like behind the right eye. Hmm. Well, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. So is it one person or two people, Phil? I think it's just one. I only see one soul. I think the I think I only see one soul. But he's talking like he's two people. It's very sad. Yeah, he had two two he had like multi two different versions of him in the, yeah. one soul but yeah he's reminds, reminds me of the film but he had 24 didn't he? like he's got two <laughs> personalities yeah <laughs> it's weird okay maybe the question is uh, the uh, 
does it need help like to cross well, or with something yeah we, we well, gotta cross it over well yeah we'll get them crossed over but i'm just trying to is he a is he a demonic being or is he a lost soul i'm kind of confused now I think he is as well. Now he's giving me the creepies. Hmm. Can you hear him? now or is it quiet for you it's quiet for you okay he's just giving me a headache now he's blo he's blocked me right uh, i'm giving him a choice yeah, like why he is appearing? Why it's appearing? I mean, totally blocked me now, just giving me a headache. So I'm sorry for that. Do you have a bad back as well? I'm getting pain from your back. Mm, sometimes, yeah. Right. What I'm offering him, just just because I want to be more vocal, I'm offering him. A nice fiery grave of death, or he goes to back to source. That's two options, no other options. Uh, he's trying to block me, but he's not making it. That's not going to happen, not happen today, anyway. I'll give him a third option, unless he wants me to take him somewhere, which is okay. So strange. Mm -hmm. For me as well. I can feel that in the eye now. Yeah, he was t stealing your life force. That's why your eyes are to your soul, isn't it? Forgot about that. He must be pretty sneaky. Check, check now, Deb. Did you feel a release then, by the way? Yes, I, I feel now some, some, like... Mm. Some I'm something going on. So he's gone. Yeah, and he he, he picked the wrong option. <laughs> he really. He picked the fighting option. <laughs> he, I mean, yeah. he, he was so weird. At first, I thought, well, and then I saw two heads, and I'm like, what is what? Trick is a bit of a and trickster. Then he, and then, I mean, for him to put a wall up where I couldn't see him anymore. Because he was dealing with you and he gives me this headache. Weird. Yeah, psychotrix energy. So um, the two heads was like uh, uh, like a false yeah. uh, look. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I actually feel relief. Yeah. Yes. Now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but that was a trickster. That wasn't a good thing. That, that was stealing your life force, your soul energy. Yeah, so you would have been feeling tired at, in the morning when you're getting up or in the night or something. You know, you would have been quite exhausted because you were you were keeping yourself alive and you're keeping this thing alive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, there must be some hole in the firewall. Like how, how mm. this entity was able to, you know, to connect. 
How did it get through, God knows. Where have you have you been with somewhere different? Have you bought any books, any old books? Any have you brought any books home from somewhere? Mm hmm Yes. Yes. Yeah, well, I know that this wasn't mine that I, I might I might have picked it up from, you know, from something from somewhere from outside. Yes, but do you know old books or books from some place else is carries energy? Mm -hmm. And usually it's that that you'll bring into your house and that's where you'll get it from. Mm -hmm. Actually, it was it was a book about El Moria ascended master. It makes That's you wonder. Whoever handled, whoever handled that book last may not have been a spiritual person. It may have been. Oh, it might have had something with him. Yeah. yeah. It, it's up to long. Do you? Yeah. Knowing that somebody spiritual would pick it up and then they mm. would get the curse on it or it got it. Pick up the... You were just. Yeah, it's... It's like... yeah, you were the food for it. That's all. But it's quite good how it yeah. it, it, it uh, changed into a two-headed thing. I think it was trying to mess with you. Yeah, that's the message I got was that it came from a book. Mm. Yeah, actually, it was more books because I've been also in, in some cafe where they had uh, books and we never know from where they come, actually. Mm. Right. Who but might my... left their energy imprint on it? Mm. My spiritual friend is now eating him. After he, f he made a fight, he did a fight, didn't he? I think Doman had him. Uh, Doman yeah. loves eating, having a snack. Um, <laughs> Doman is a dragon. <laughs> um, I, would, I would put some salt uh, on all over that book. Nice salt. Mm -hmm. And leave it outside in the sun or. Oh, smudge. Uh, do you do smudging at all? Smudge it. Yeah. Yeah, smudge it. Yeah, with Paulo Santos. It outside and, and smudge it. Just leave it outside for a little bit. <laughs> but it should be okay after that. I don't think there's anything else on it. Your back pain's probably, well, your back, the energy in your back's gone. I'm glad you came today. I'm really glad you came today. Something brought you here. It was that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the, the cards, by the way, set a goal. Go. And divine love, open your heart chakra to divine love. You might get a new friend. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. What was that first card, please? Set your intention, set a goal. Mm -hmm. A new goal, Intent a new goal, a new goal. It's set intentions, a new goal. And new love, which is divine love. Open your heart chakra to divine love, and you might get a new friend. There you go. Yeah. Okay. And, and I, I thought someone just told me next card, do the next card. It's a soulmate. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. They were telling me, yeah, get third card. Third card will give you the information that you want. So there you go. <sighs> I'll send some healing into you now. Uh, I'll give you some of my chi energy because obviously your life force is being drained by this parasite that you've been having clinging on to you. Thank you.
。ディフェイは。Why do you actually、yeah. do spirit, spiritual? Because I was getting ela, ela, ela in my back of my head. So, have you ever tried healing?、Hmm? Yeah. You do healing, yeah. I'm,、well, I'm, I'm being trying. Yeah, I'm being told you're an healer. And I think they've just helped you with a code. Download, yeah, download. Yeah.、Oh. Open it up and the world's actually set your gold intentions. Yeah. Was there anything else, Deb? I didn't pick anything really bad. No, I just,、uh, we sent、uh, Father's energy through her from the top all the way down, white human、mm. lights. I did Christ consciousness. I have been told that that being, that trickster, actually cleared any, nothing else would go near you because you got a trickster on you. <laughs> so you were protected by him in a way, <laughs> but not in a good way. Yeah. I can't think of that. Yeah, I, sh I should work more、uh, on、uh, protection and shielding.、Yeah. Hmm. Ask your angels and、um, your guides to do that for you every day.、Hmm. Especially your guides. You, you have to ask them for help. That your angels automatically protect you. Your guides, you have to give them a job to do because of free will. I'm being told if you want to bring, on, bring bigger energies and use the pillars of light to go higher dimensions to higher chakras. Like the 22nd is Christ conscious, which I just used on you. The use of pillars of light and meditation. Go to the Christ conscious, which is platinum r a t e and just bring it in to your hands. Yeah. And now, now and again, Yoshua says he's on commission. <laughs> Where's my commission? <laughs> But it's just a standing joke between, between them. <laughs>、yeah. Okay, you ready? Yeah. You yeah, that, that was true, by the way. He has done that. Done that on them. Right. Anything else? Any questions? <laughs> Well,、yep. just, just like fast、uh, check on implants if there is something.、Um, then you, you've, got, you've got none, you've got zero. Okay,、yeah. perfect. You didn't, have、um, the, uh, you didn't have this, did you? Don't think you did. Did you have that? We would have, we would have、uh, said that right away if you had implants. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It, okay. Did, have you had anything, in, anything here in the last three years now? Don't think you have. Like the, the, the right arm? No. Yeah, have you, you know, had any? We can't, we can't <laughs> say it. We can't say it. <laughs> no. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't think yet.、Yeah. Did anyone have them? <laughs> so, I, actually, I, have, I can reverse it, that's why I asked. Allegedly. But, allegedly. Yeah, allegedly. And <laughs> this, is for, this is for entertainment purposes only. <laughs> <laughs> We're、okay. here to entertain you. <laughs>、uh, We do song and dance later.、Mm. <laughs> We're going to go on now, Lily. Yeah. Okay. Thank right. you very much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you.、Yeah. Thank you, too. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We are going、um, soon, Nils. Soon, Nils. Soon, Nils. Soon, Nils. Hello. You are dark. Turn on your light. Turn on your light. Your light. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I forgot. forgot. <laughs> okay, sorry. Turn on the light.、Yeah. How are you doing since we saw you last? Well, I've got a lot of、uh, energy coming into my head. I don't really exactly know what, what? what it is, but.、Uh, yeah, some energy. energy that comes into、yeah. my head all the time. All right. All the time, all the time comes into my head. I, I've got, an, I, we know what, what, what's happened. We won't say it here, but I'm being implied to take you to the underworld to a blessing. Oh boy. Yeah, and everyone、okay. can join us. This is the light, white、yeah. side of the underworld. And this is, so I know you don't, you can't do, can you do remote viewing? 
I don't know. Just by intentions, join us. So everyone who's watching can can go to the underworld. Let's go to the underworld. Uh, it costs you nothing. So <laughs> yeah, a free ride. A free ride to the underworld. I was thinking this is the only way that what you've agreed to we can clear it. If it works, it works. It doesn't, doesn't. This is the mm. best. This is the one that saved my life. This is the one that I had an energy vampire I couldn't get off. And my guides took me there. And all my experience was unique. And I've never read it before. I read it after, some of it. And it was quite a wow moment. So if have we... You, uh, have, hmm? you asked, have you run an aster? Asked, asked. Permission well, I'm okay to go in there now anyway. Yeah, okay. it'd be okay. It'd be fine. All right. Yeah, I've been told that me, Crystal Source, being said it's okay. So if we just close our eyes, we can all go. And just imagine we're a big field with a river next to it. So in the field with the river next to it, big sunny day, sun's shining. And in front is an oak tree. Yeah, big wide oak tree. But the oak tree is a portal to the inner earth. So we go actually go into the inner earth first, and we'll go to the underworld. So uh, just get in the zone, start breathing, breathing exercises. In, in, keep on breathing, breathing. And remember, intentions to come with us. All of us can come. And when we meet the goddess of the earth, ask what you need. Yeah? Okay, ask what you need. Right, obviously... You know what you need, so so big breathe, breathe in from these contracts. Yeah, and breathing out. And breathing in. I'll try and do it in ten minutes. This breathing out. So we're seeing this big oak tree. It's about two thousand, maybe three thousand years old. Next to the river stream, river. And then we go in. Say goodbye to the sun, go into the thing. And as we go in into the oak tree, it's like a whirling, like a dot through sort of cycle of rainbow energies going round and round. And we're going round and round and we're going all the way down, all the way down to the inner earth, in the earth, go into the inner, inner, inner earth. And there we are. So we're in the inner earth. And we're getting there, we're getting there, getting there. Yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. So we get to go for the ride. We're in. We arrive at the bottom of the oak tree, and we're in inner earth. Inner earth is there's a sprite there. There's giants, uh, dragons, everything. We got a pass to go in. My team's with us, so we're we're protected. We're protected from any dangers. Yes, yeah, we are. Um, the beings are quite quite interested in us, but uh, they won't bother us. So we've got to walk from the inner, from the tree, and we walk, and at the far end you see a glow. The glow is golden gates of the underworld. There's two golden dragons. This, these dragons are guarding the underworld from, obviously, uh, the underworld from the inner, inner earth. So we're entering, and we're entering also. When we enter the gates, we're going in dimensionally into a very high vibrational area. This is the light side of the underworld, not the dark side, which we would have trouble in. So the gates are opening. We're going in, going in, and it's like, I've, oh, no, we're not going in. I've got to have a word with the dragon. Sorry. I preempted. What would, can we go in? He needs a blessing. Yeah. Right, we're allowed in. The gates are opening. Uh, I think I banged my head actually before. Right, the gates are opening and we're going in and we're going in and it's like, it's like a yellow brick road, but not quite yellow. So, so it's like the Wizard of Oz, but not quite yellow. So we've got to walk down this yellow brick road. You can look, these goblins on the side is uh, not mermaids. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm saying, fairies, that's it. It's fairies, sprites, and his weird beings of all sorts of magic. But these are all nice beings. Uh, the inner eye vibration, so they're not like fairies can be quite nasty, but these aren't. These are nice. Uh, there's mushrooms the size of trees on both sides. Uh, and we're just going to walk on. We're walking on in the underworld. We're walking on. 
Uh, keep on doing them breath work, keep on trying to say it and carrying on. And in that uh, ahead of us is the tree of knowledge. The tree of knowledge is a golden, golden tree of knowledge. It's glowed, golden. You can brush into it. Don't go into it. It's portals in there and you could get lost. So we're going past the tree of knowledge. Say so hello, like tree of knowledge. Just, just guide. To take, it, can, it can give you positive vibes anyway. Ready for the... For the uh, ready for the blessing so the tree of knowledge by the way is alive not just the tree but the vibration everything is pure conscious it's it's like it's like being source it's, it's, it's basically and that goes from the underworld all the way up to the heavens above us uh so we're going past it's in the north pole by the way uh we're going past the tree of knowledge and we're going all the way around Going around, come on, speed up, speed up. It's taking a while, this takes about, this has been hours, but it's, it's outside our realm, so we're okay. It's quicker. And ahead is the Ealing Sea of the Underworld, the light, white, bright sea, and it should be shiny. It should be, it's like it's like getting a tan from it. It's that like golden, that bright, that high vibration. And we're going, and if you have a look in the sea, there's, a, there's actually two goddesses. So even though it's a goddess of the earth, there's two of them, two consciousness. They've got a goblets, and we go in there and we ask permission, and we ask permission to the goddesses what we actually need. Now I'm just, I'm going to just ask for a blessing uh, to lift my vibration. Anyone who's got anything that really want, they want to remove, uh, like contracts or anything like that, ask for that, and then you'll just lay. Yeah, yeah. Ask to go. Ask. Wait to go in. They'll guide you in. The guiding us all in, and we just lay on the Ealing Sea, the underworld. Now, this this is like the Black Sea, where you can float. It floats, you don't sink on it because it's high vibration. It like lifts us, and then the goddess of the underworld is now doing. She's doing light language. She's like, I don't. Just, she's like blessing the actual water as well. It's blessed water, so she's setting a program into the water to do the contract that we've all asked for. That's, yep, that's it. Uh, so she's asking for the, yeah, she's she's programming the water, uh, Ealing Sea, she's programming it to do the intentions that we've asked for. And we're laying down and they're pouring over with a light and they're doing more light language, more blessings, more blessings, forgiveness. You, you, if you can do remote viewing, you might see a bit of dark stuff coming up and just pouring it off, pouring it off. And that's it, yep. Well, some act <laughs> Yep, excellent. Thank you. Yeah, remember the fact you know, basically be really courteous and nice and thanking thank you for this blessing. Thank you very, very much. And yes, okay. Uh, a few more seconds, they're still doing a bit of work. These have got like goblets and it's pouring, pouring there. That's it. Thank you. Okay. And that part's done, so we can get out the under we can get out the sea. We go out the sea of the underworld and we gotta follow our steps back. We've got to follow our steps back. And uh, we're just saluting. Thank you. Praying. Yeah. Can't remember the word. It's not really pray, it's just a uh, courtesy. And then we're going walking down the yellow brick road again. Oh, it's not even yellow, but and then we're going past the tree and that. Right, the, the, the tree of knowledge has said if you want any codes and downloads, just put your hand in, ask for the download that you want. I didn't expect that. No. Uh, yeah. I want to be a super being. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Download what I need. That's it. Right, what I need. Right, we've had downloads. Now we're going walking by, walking by, walking by. And going back to the mushrooms mushrooms gate gates in front golden gates thank you always be courtesy because they're high vibrational beings the two golden dragons thank you very much thank you yeah i'm not saying what you told me i probably know too much and this time when we go in the tree of knowledge i've been told we can come back here we can come back straight down back back in our bodies so we go into the tree of knowledge 
I mean, another tree, like the oak tree, the oak tree. We're going the oak tree. It's circling, 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 circling. And we're back. And just keep your eyes shut. Rub your hands together. Get that lovely energy, lovely downloads. If you've, you've been touching the tree of knowledge, just put it to your eyes. Breathe. And we're back. And then that's it. How was that? <laughs> Never done that one before. Did you enjoy that? Yeah, that was a special, wasn't it? That that really happened. That saved my life once. I was dying. So, did you feel anything, Sonny? No, I can't feel anything. But uh... yeah. But you know what, me, don't. What, what, uh... No. Ch chances are, then, contract, if you actually intentionally went with us, any contracts you sign could be you now ripped up and void. They're the only beings that can do that. Yeah. Okay. Did you feel anything, okay. Deb, or did you not no. go? Yeah? Right. It's good, wasn't it? Uh -huh. It's a great place. I, so once you go, can you can I verify go. verify that it was done? Just say it's been done. So, uh, uh, I'll, we'll send you a bit of e we'll send you a bit of healing, but that probably took a bit. How long did that take? That <laughs> I want time in it. <sighs> okay, but that really happened, and I I was dying at two a.m. in the morning, and my doman, my guardian, took me there, and remember, yeah, the Sybil Well, where I went. He was talking about the civil well. Facing it, it in this book, which I put on me, I actually put on my Facebook. It describes the tree, and not everything was the same. I couldn't believe it, but I read it after I went there. So I'll send you some more healing. Actually, I'll do cards for you. Let's see what cards. Now you've had that blessing, but I've told you how to go. You could try it yourself. Try it yourself in meditation yeah. with intent. Try and imagine it doing it. If you can't see remote view, try and imagine it. That's the first sign of remote viewing. Right, Archangel, I've managed to get Archangel Michael to help you. Yes. I don't know why. Why would he help me? Sign the contract. Balance. New beginnings. There's a chance this has worked, actually. So, balance. If you need help, ask your guides. You guys okay. are listening to you. The new beginnings is set yourself a goal. Uh, no, I'd say set yourself new opportunities. That's it. Mm -hmm. New project. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't dwell what you've done. Okay. New projects that gets lighting, that right. gets your power. Go in your power. Right. Okay. I'll send you some healing. Shall we send some healing, Deb? And how it was. Right, I finished. A lot of water. Right. Okay. I'd ask you, I'd ask you any questions, and you'll just say, "Is it now been done?" And I'd say, "I don't know. <laughs> don't know. Hopefully, it has. That's the only beings I know who can do that, unless it's direct from source. Yeah." But we are source beings, so we've got the power inside. I did try and uh, set intentions to cut cords. So when I was healing you, in case there's any, even though I'm probably breaking the ruler. So. <laughs> okay. Okay.
Last one, I think we're on the last one, Lily. Julian, who else? I thought it was Julian. I thought you changed your name. <laughs> Julian and Julian. <laughs> mm. You can call yeah. me Julian. Yeah. How are you? Did you go on that trip? Yeah, I did. Of course I did. I was hosting it. <laughs> <laughs> you hosted it. <laughs> it's funny. I was talking to Ivan Teller and I was like talking about the underworld and he was like, he's like, yeah, you've been there. You go there. You were there earlier today. It's kind of like tourism. <laughs> <laughs> Which side though? Is it the light side or the dark side? The best side always. What? The best side. Yeah. The, the dark side, side is, is, I have been there. It's, you don't want to stay there too long. <laughs> yeah. Um, I also sent some money for Deb because Chris is here too. If you can do one more, this is like the old days, the good old days where we had six hour healings. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Deb doesn't. I'm 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 holding on here. I'm holding on. Yeah, everybody's all dirtied up, dirtied up. Yeah. <laughs> Sure. All right, so you want to do Chris first or you? Uh, you can do Chris first. I'll be a or whatever you want to do. Yeah. It's up to you. You're driving there right now. You can go. I, I won't break the code. Yeah. Dad, by the way, Susan just said, is it still on? <laughs> so I might have someone else coming. <laughs> Hi, Chris. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. Just for like a general um, quick of a scan and healing. Okay. Can you turn your speaker up? Your volume? Yes, sir. Yeah, talk louder. Yeah. Talk louder. All right. Something on the back of his neck. Your neck been bothering you? Um, a little bit recently, yeah. Yeah, you've got a. It doesn't look like an implant, but it's. Oh, it's moving. <laughs> so he's got a um, parasite, spiritual implant. What, I, yeah, I, I, it's, a parasite, it's a pa parasite. It's parasite. parasite. <laughs> it's a square box that's moving. <laughs> yeah. And now it's got legs. It could be an AI parasite. It's, uh, it's black and now it's got legs. Hmm. He, he's been inheriting some of your old stuff there, yeah. Jillian. <laughs> it's just not cockroaches and spiders now. It's like little boxes with legs. It feels like an AI parasite. It's like a combination, isn't it? Yeah. I love our contact. It's a sloppy one, though. It's not going to uh, run very fast, is it? Like a little kid put it together. <laughs> Somebody just said something nasty to me. Whoever, whoever put that in doesn't like what I said. Yeah. Hmm. I actually have uh, every year. I, I could win that. <laughs> Modern art. So sorry to insult you, dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> Well, 
Oh, we just took our internet and lowered the frequencies. <laughs> hmm. Oh, now my bandwidth is back. Excuse me. There's some energy been taken off your back. We're just going to get this little thing. Got a tracker okay. around his waist. And the the, the uh, whatever it was just been removed. Yeah, he's got. He, he doesn't have a tracker on his feet. He's got a tracker around his waist. It's um, mm. it's a weird looking tracker. It's like this thin thin wire. Like thin, it almost looks like it's almost invisible, like fishing line. Mm. He likes spaghetti. Well, for for dirt, for Bob it is anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm Italian, so yeah, I, I love pasta. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's gone. That's clear. Yeah. Did you have a bit of bad back? Um, no, I wouldn't say so. I have bad posture, but not a bad back. <laughs> Something, something in the back of his knees. It's shiny metal in the back of each knee. Almost like reflectors. So like if you were riding a bike no that wouldn't even work because your legs are bent but if you were like say it's, it's almost like something that would, i don't know what they're for they're shiny are those trackers too phil Mm, oh, they're changing it to regular. I'll just get rid of them. I can't tell. They're weird looking, but they're, they're just reflective. Mm. I couldn't miss them if I tried. Mm. I don't see anything else on him. He is a, a spirit around him. I think that's family. Male. Grandfather. Is your grandfather born? Um, yeah. Yeah. Mm, I think Are you close to him? Your mother's father? Um not really. He died when I was pretty young, so I wouldn't say so. I don't know if he, he was it's just a an oldish male spirit that's around you. Yeah. Obviously not male, but he he identifies himself to what he was here. Yeah, he's really fond of you, very fond. Mm. Well, you can let your mom know that your mom around. Well, if you think about it, if you were very young, that's all he knows, doesn't it? So yeah. to him, it, you might be a lot closer than what. You are to him because you weren't, you don't remember that much. If your mom's around. Let her know that uh, her dad's around you. Mm -hmm. do. Good energy. Yeah. Oh. 
Jillian's turn now. Oh, hold on. Card. Your, your cards, wait, your cards. <laughs> think, think what you're thinking these cards need to give you. I'll try and link them up. All right, that's done. Music, frequency, manifestation, signs. What do they mean? Are they linked there? That's what you got. So, spirit or angels, I suppose, are giving you signs. So, yeah, just follow the signs. Manifestation, which means basically you'll see peace on the way. Yeah, you can create, but then use frequency. If that makes all sense. And your grandfather's around. That's a nice sign. Yeah. Mm. Thanks, guys. I appreciate that. You're right. welcome. <laughs> you want to see our co-creation? Oh, that's yeah, nice. That's nice. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Gosh. That's really nice. Yay. Thank you. Christmas. Together. That's mm. nice. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Yeah, you know who was really co cooperative and helpful after our last. Hmm? After our last um dealing was my dad. Oh. <laughs> wow. And how is he cooperative? Um, I think he had like a little a little uh, medical scare, but then it turned out to be okay, but I think it made him realize some things and um yeah, just think differently and be extra helpful and I'm glad. Yeah. Um yeah. And then, yeah, I just get word that I'm still releasing stuff from my father. So he needs he needs to do that helping me. Um, oh, they can do a, dads can do a number on us. I had to release a lot from mine. Yeah, he did have a bad job. He had a rough childhood. He did. He took care of all the um, So yeah, really. my father did not have a rough childhood. <laughs> he didn't have any excuse. <laughs> so what does that mean? Is that like releasing like family stuff? Huh? What is that? If I'm releasing stuff from my dad or like, is that like family lineage stuff? Could be. You know? I'm getting, trying to get a message. You're releasing stuff from this lifetime that you remember, but you had another lifetime with him too. So, oh, okay. Um, um, yeah. I think you were his mother. Yeah. Oh, wow, for real? <laughs> uh, I think he might have not been an he. Not been what? Oh, okay. He might have been a she. Nowadays, you don't even know. But <laughs> them days you did. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we know this nowadays. We know. <laughs> There's still the plumbing that you have to consider. <laughs> uh, uh. He's all testosterone up. I was thinking one day I could get pregnant, couldn't I? <laughs> if you want to have a baby, go ahead. Carry the kid. Yeah, you, you, you go ahead. Let's, see. Let's see how that works out for you. <laughs> Uh, push. <laughs> oh, good. Good topic. So, okay, so clearing stuff from past lives, and I was possibly his mother. Your cards, by the way. 
I think you're possibly clearing just this life because if you were his mother. Yeah. Spiritual growth. Good one. With music, frequency, and a soulmate. Okay. Maybe you have to forgive yourself. For um, wanting this bullshit. For maybe, maybe, maybe he's treating you badly, or it's it's revenge for what you did to him as his mother. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Weird. Mm. Probably ducked him. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor, you wanted a male, just put it in the river. <laughs> Remember, we, we if when we have more than one lifetime with people, we had we Yeah. You know. I killed my mom in a past life. She was like a spider and I cooked her and ate her, so uh, that's probably why she hates me. <laughs> but I tried to make it right in this life. Are you sure are you sure it wasn't this life that you could <laughs> <laughs> Uh, my mother, you know, this life's been so weird, but mm. I tried, but if, yeah, if, yeah, if you well, try to kill me on Thanksgiving, it's, you've got know. no, you got no implants. I'm not yeah. picking any implants. No. Yeah, I just like have, still have like a s s red snakes or something coming out of my lips, snake lips. Um, mm. So working that out, it really hurts. She still has something in her lips. Yeah, here. Mm. Something here. It's working out. Um, it's just taking months, but it hurts. D didn't you ask the goddess of the underworld to get rid of it for you? Well, yeah, I have an in and out pass. <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't know. I've been working this red fucking, excuse my language, fucking snake thing. Snake, I don't know, red snakes, red. A rat yeah, snake. Do, do you have a rat snake? Red, like red, 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 like creature. Do you have pressure in your head, like an headache, but not quite an headache? It is. It is a female witch. That's. It's not a red snake. It's a female witch. Yeah. Hmm. It's not an aspect, is it? No. <laughs> what? What the hell? Why? I see. I see exactly who it is. <sighs> she wears red all in uh, red scarlet <laughs> scarlet yeah. isn't phil's daughter named scarlet it's her she changes uh, it how do you a how do you know that are you inspired on me <laughs> I know. she changes herself into a witch i mean into a snake a red snake she's she even has red hair Red you know, do you know, we said, we called her Scarlet, and she had red hair when she was born, we already named her, and she's the only one who had red hair out of all the family. Mm. You have a beautiful family, though, but that's yeah. a pretty... Yeah, got a beautiful dad, I think, they were. My mother was a redhead. A model. Mm. Yeah, my daughter, my daughter Scarlet was asked to, to go in to be Weasley in Harry Potter and she didn't open the email for six months after and they'd already got the person. I think she could have won. She was she's is photogenic, but that's why isn't it? Yeah, but she's a bit she's a bit dumb, I think. <laughs> what are we doing with these uh, this rich then? Yeah. All right, what I'm doing, I'm giving her a choice. I can send her to places that don't affect humanity. I could uh, send her to source. Have you, have, uh, you ever, have you ever met a, um, a red-haired witch before? Um, Did your father ever date a redhead? My dad? Uh, was her name... After he was with my mom, he dated the, this chick like Ro or Roz or something, Ro, but 
Red hair? I maybe a little. I'm not sure. It's All funny. right. You brought up your dad. Or why, do been... you, why do I think he, this woman is connected to your dad? Because my dad knows a lot of people. Huh? He knows a lot of people. So this this red dad witch is still alive. Yes. So I could bind her. Uh, that is light. It's not dark. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure she's alive because she's she is. I, I don't. I'm. Well, actually, I can't tell you for sure, but I believe she's connected to her dad. I'll I'll call in the plant and dad spirits. Dad would know about it. Your, your dad would know about it, but she somehow. Why would she come after you? I have no idea. Just to get at your dad, probably. I will use the plant spirits to bind her. Uh, until the, until she keeps good energies, okay. Or do you want to reverse it? Reverse it on her? No, it binds the power. It stops it being it. Send the power out. She has no power. She can't do this to anybody. Then the thing is, when she starts being good, then the plant roots will dissolve. So for some reason she's, been, and I have a feeling it's whoever is working against you because you're working for the good in the astral. They are using people to get to you. Mm -hmm. They're going through, yeah, they'll use anybody. So they go through whoever they can, whether it's through your father. Or, mm -hmm. Can you feel any of this, Jillian? Uh Oh, feels great. I don't see the lines coming down the side anymore. I saw them when you first came on. It looked like you had blood coming down the sides. That's what I saw. Like it's looked like that. Like Chris has seen me. It's it's looked like I've been eating blood or something. Like yes. Uh, don't. I don't see it anymore. The power's been blocked. Find it, find it. Thanks. That, that's not dark. That's light. <laughs> I think. <laughs> but at the end of the day, people shouldn't mess with other people, should they? Yeah, they're breaking the universal law. They're breaking universal mm. law. They're not allowed to do this shit. Mm. Yeah, get it in galactic court. Mm. <laughs> no more. Yeah, well, the red-headed okay. snake is the red. The red snake is, is gone now. For... Is it Medusa? It's Medusa. Yeah. I said a long time ago. No, mm. no, no. I don't know her name. Is it Raquel? I just saw her though. As soon as you started talking about a red snake, I was going, and then I saw her face and the red hair, and I was like, "Whoa, it's not a snake. It's a woman." <laughs> <laughs> Go on. All right. Bind it. Huh? Oh, but did they give you a, I gave you a free card, didn't I? Yeah. yeah. Free card? I'm giving you free cards. So I got to pay this week. Your spiritual growth, music, and soulmate. You're going to meet someone as soulmate. Oh, I have um, meeting forks if you want me to play them. Go on then. I'm tired. She's like, get me off this. <laughs> mm. All right. Is there one more person I can play? Deb, Susan said, can I book a session? On FaceTime. Okay. She couldn't get in. Susan. Is any anybody else? Have we done everyone? Yeah. Okay. Did everyone enjoy that? Yeah. Should I close it with a sound healing? Yeah, Susan who? Uh, Susan Erin. Uh, Erin. Oh, Susan. I haven't seen her for a long time. Yeah. She can't get in the... But she said, can I book a session like we used to do on Messenger? I really miss seeing you free. Oh, yeah, yeah Susan. Sure. But after this or later? Or when? Oh, not tonight. <laughs> I'm tired. 
tomorrow night? Um, we have one to tomorrow. Um, uh, it, well, when do we, we have we have one tomorrow? Do do we have that one with you or just us? I can't remember. I'll, it's just uh, I have one at six tomorrow, so it, you're crazy. One your one our time, six your time. We can do it. What six at my time tomorrow? Okay. Yeah, we have one uh, that booked with us. Oh, what time will it be for her? It would be one o'clock in the afternoon for her. Uh, give me a second. That should do sound healing to end the. Anyone got any questions? Or have we done everyone? And I'm just going. I can play. Hey. Some board if you want. Yeah. Go yeah. on. You want me to play some some forks at the same time to you? Yeah, go on. Oh, all right. Yeah. Good. Good idea. Band. Hmm? Like we're in a band. Who in a band? <laughs> we need to ground ourselves after this anyway, because of all we. Yeah, well, it, this is grounding anyway, isn't it? Are you playing? So I'm setting intentions to ground everyone and clear everyone. <laughs> month we'll be channeling messages it won't be healing so we will channel well, well we i didn't know that <laughs> yes that's what we did the last month yeah okay. it'll be message channeling so <sighs> message channeling. okay yes and it'll be rick's birthday month question for mm. you philip well quick question for you yeah go on I thought we closed it. We'll go on. Hmm? Two weeks or something like that. What's that? Wait a week. Yeah, or two weeks. Week, yeah. week. Take your power back. Okay. Do all the work. It's your job to do the work. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Thank you, everybody. Okay. We'll see you next month. Yeah, okay. it, was, it was only five hours. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you then. Thank you okay. all so much. Thank you. Oh, oh, we enjoyed it all. That's better than the BBC, isn't it? Yeah, yes, it is. <laughs> hmm. I want to see if I can get the YouTube off. Thank you. Have a great weekend. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. All right, bye. Take care. Is Lily asleep? <laughs> I think she is. I think she is. <laughs> Let me stop the recording. Bye. I'm Bye. going. Bye, I I'm drowning.